big update. Tens of thousands new questions. Questions with a level of difficulty and themes accessible to the youngest player with a timer. Timer? Without timer. Timer is annoying, alright? Because I have to listen to my left ear. I'm not reading chat, but. Alright. Are you sure? Yes. Oh shit, I have to waste these. Oh, but I have. Okay, let's do all categories. That way, we're not being a you know. Like I don't want I don't want soccer. I I, I don't know anything about soccer, right? But I'm going to leave it because uh, assuming the ratio of questions is all fair, it will be fair, right? And whatever category is the uh, history, it's so much US history. It's... All right, let's leave all categories God Gamer mode, right? Uh, let's leave it on. Julie, 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 I'm George, caregiver. Yeah, that's what I am. Ancient art is the passion. Ancient art. To win a million, no one has ever done that before. Be a millionaire. Hello, thank you. thank you. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for having me. I'm I'm excited to try my luck. Good luck. Here we go. Well, you know the money ladder. Fifteen questions, and at the top, the million. To help you, we have four lifelines at your disposal. Phone a friend, the 50-50, ask the audience, and switch the question. Are you ready for this new question? I'm ready. What is the title? What title is placed before Voldemort's name? Lord Voldemort. A. Come on, George. Focus, Five I'm choosing A. I know you are waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. Is this your final answer? Oh, yes, that's my final answer. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct answer. You don't know. You got it right, well done. And 
one more right answer for me. Lower game volume. Is it really loud? Oh shit. Well, I think we all agree that right we now. can move on to this new question. We have to wait. Which word can mean a Scandinavian or a vegetable? Uh, hmm. Or a vegetable? Uh, or a vegetable? Dane is a pastry, right? I actually know. Uh, Swede, Norwegian. I'm gonna go with Dane because I, I don't know. I'm certain that it's B. Is that your final answer? Yes, that's. My what the I fuck? To to you, the this is not the right answer. Okay, I, I did it on purpose so I can what fix the audio levels. Dumb mistake on my What the fuck is a Swede? I have to go with this one. Uh huh. Looks like a turnip. It's a turnip. Okay, okay. Yeah, I mean, I had to uh, exit to get the horn, you know, it's a lot of shit. Alright, here we go. Without timer. Alright, we'll give George another try now that I'm serious. Which of these describes something which causes stress or anxiety? A nerve wracking. I think that the right answer is B. That's what we were looking Final for. answer! That's right. Oh, that, that's perfect. That's perfect. Your new question is ready. Good luck. Which of these phrases commonly refers to an over enthusiastic person? An avid rabbit, eager beaver. A wakeful weasel, fervent ferret. Well, uh, now, eager beaver. I'm certain that it's B. Yes, Woo! absolutely. That was the right answer. Turn awesome. Box. awesome. <laughs> Here's a new question for you. City is black. <laughs> I get oh, a reference because um, it's the cheating side. <laughs> no more hesitation. Oh, thank you. I'm gonna say D. And now to the most important question of all: Is this your final? Well done. You got it. Oh, that, that's perfect. Spoilers. And let's go for a whole new question. Which sign of the zodiac is symbolized by the water carrier? Uh. Symbolized by the water carrier. But why did I have to be the one to get this question? What is the piscis? They're the fishies. I don't fucking know the English one. I mean, it's not Sagittarius. I'm Sagittarius. That's an archer. Uh, piscis are the fishes. Uh, Gemini. I don't. Remember how that looks like. Aquarius is aqua in it. I'm just gonna gamble on that. I'm choosing D. Final answer? Oh, yes. That's my final answer. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. <laughs> you got it right. Well done.
Hey, shut the table, Prime Sub. One more yeah, right answer for me. Good All luck right. to you for this new question. According to the title of a 1968 hit single, Marvin Gaye heard it. Where? Going to say A, okay? Are you absolutely sure? Well done. Let's go for this new eliminatory. All right. Which holiday does the Macy's Day Parade commemorate? Macy's Day Parade sounds like. Uh, but why did I have to be the one to get Macy's this question? Macy's Day Parade. I feel like Macy's, isn't that the like shopping center or some shit in the States? In New York? Uh, then they have a parade. Uh, from watching Christmas movies, they have a parade, but also Thanksgiving, I think. Uh, but I would say it's a uh, Christmas. I think there's a I think there's a parade. I wonder if that's a Macy's Day parade. They have in a lot of Christmas movies. Um, yeah, I'm trying to think of Thanksgiving movies, but that's not a thing. Really. Labor Day. I don't even know what Labor Day is really, I'm gonna be honest. Alright, I'm uh, I'm thinking it's A, but I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take a lifeline here. And I'm going to uh do a 50-50 and they're gonna remove end of summer and Thanksgiving and I'm gonna be sad. Okay, we will take two incorrect answers away. Okay. I'm gonna go with Christmas. YOLO. I'm choosing A. You seem to be convinced, but is this your final well, answer? Sen, please, 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 answer this question, please, 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 Fumel, 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 Fumel. Alright, Georgia sucks. We're thinking Nadia. She's a hairdresser. She talks to a lot of interesting people. A lot of knowledge. Question shouldn't give you up. It's A. I'm sure of it. Is that your final answer? Um, that's my final answer. You really Ooh. know your answers. All right. I think we all agree that we can move I like it when the sports question. questions are coming in the early game. That way I can even I can get some of them. A person at his wit's end is said to be losing his uh, marbles. B is the right answer. B. That's what we were looking for. Trust. <laughs> in volleyball, the ball is kept in the air using which part of the body? Uh I mean, hands, but aren't you allowed to kick the ball or no? Maybe not. Okay. I'm, I'm just I'm like thinking out loud. Obviously, it's hands. But and now to the most important I'm, question yeah. of all. I think Is you're allowed to. Your final answer. You are in indoors volley. Oh, yes. That's my final answer. You have given your final answer. You got it right. Well done. 
Okay, this is no time to get tired. Let's go. No, I can afford one fisting. New question coming up. Good luck to you. On what planets do the Wookiees live? Oof. Okay. Uh. It's either. I think it's C. Like first, I think it's C. But I mean, it's definitely not Tatooine. Um. Uh, Yeah, I think it's A or C, but I don't know. I don't. I'm a fake fan. I'm a fake fan, man. It's been too long. Uh, Disney has fucked my asshole with all this new shit. Um, I'm gonna do a fifty-fifty. Uh, nah, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna call somebody that okay, I used to know. Let's get a friend on the line. I'm gonna call. How old am I? 27. My brother doesn't. know oh shit. Uh, aunt shows no shit. Alfred, family friend. Marco, maybe older cousin. Uh, Marco. I'm calling Marco. Hello, Marco. This is who wants to be a millionaire calling you. No way! Ah, oh, is this to help Nadia? Oh, I hope she's doing great. So far, yes. But she's going to need your help. She's struggling a bit with this question. Eek! More than just a bit. I need your Don't help. Don't read the Marco. question. I'm completely stuck. If I were on the stage, I'd say B, but hey, I'm not there. What? I mean. I guess. Uh, yeah, I mean these two I recognize, so they're probably used more. So it makes sense that it's this. Right? All set for D. But I don't recognize this at all. I'll be honest. Yes, that's my final answer. You have made your choice. You oh my god. Easy. You got it. Alright. And there you have it. Another right answer. I'm amazed Thanks, Marco. Myself. Let's go for this new eliminatory question. From 2009 to 2017, what were the first names of the US Vice President and his wife? Ah, oh, man. What is this? Barack Obama? Uh... I think I know, but yes, yes, I'm gonna follow my gut. I guess Joe was the vice president, was he not? Joe Biden, was he not? I think he was the vice president, maybe. I don't recognize Jack. John is probably Jeff. I'm, I'm gonna go with Joe. I have to choose, and that choice will be D. I don't know shit about politics, but it rings a bell. That. Woo! Ah, we're good now, motherfuckers. We're good now. You Biden, you saved my asshole. Our team of editors offers you a new question. What? New? In Morse code, which letter is represented by dot dot dot? Ooh, dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. Yeah, I, this is going to be a gamble for me. I mean, it would be somewhere It would be somewhere uh, later on in the second half of the alphabet, for sure. Which all of these are. So, that's not much helpful. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to save myself some time here and ask the audience okay audience big one here pick up yeah. those keypads and enter your votes now surely someone knows Pro oh probably a bad question to ask the audience honestly but uh i'm gonna go with uh, d s all set for d are you absolutely sure is that your final answer that's my final answer 
Okay, the computer validated your answer. Okay. Woo! Right. Well done. I think full credit. That was a close one for me. Phew. For you? Do you know SOS? I don't know SOS. If I knew SOS, then now I would have go gotten the question, question right without the audience want. now, wouldn't I? When was the first monthly Hello, Age of Fush. Apocalypse comic release? <laughs> Here is the question. Where is Sanjay? Uh, in Uganda. B. In Finland. In Spain. In D. Finland? Inside your apartment. Uh, I'm guessing D. Uh, <laughs> Alright. First monthly age of apocalypse comic released. I don't actually know which one this is. Uh, I don't know which one this is. Uh, so this is gonna be a, like a pure guess for me. Um, so I think we're gonna have to switch the question. You I don't know. Your I don't know. Line. You are careful. Well done. It's X-Men. Yeah, if this was DC, it would have been easier. But they throw Marvel at me, man. The game is off to a good start, but you shouldn't stop there. Here is a new question. Which is the capital? What is the cap? What is the capital of South Dakota? Man. Uh, the only thing that sticks out out of these is this one. Uh, so I'm just gonna guess it. I'm not gonna it's be me. lost. I'm sure of it. Lifeline. You had to make a choice. Is that your final answer? Yellow. Yellow. Oh yes, that's my final answer. You have given your final answer. Now is the time to see the right one. That's the one that sounds most American. I noticed Fuck. your hesitation. You should have listened to that voice. That's the wrong answer. <sighs> no. Fuck. Really? I lost. Alright, that's. I have an idea. Oops. We picked the UK one. Surely there won't be as many American geography and American history, right? We get more Europore version. I think so. Or international. I don't know. Hope so. Do the Swedish one. We don't have a Swedish one then. Alright. This time we're gonna win. She was pretty good, but we need someone better. We need Heng. 19. Designer who likes music. Wow. Insert any motherfucking 19. Right there. We fill out each other's blanks. He knows all the Zoomer shit, and I know all the Boomer shit. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, Mr. Crowley, AJ, Tomer, Big Blaze, and Fungnub. Thank you, boys. Welcome back, welcome. Who, which of these is a means of keeping a farm animal in its field? Electric fence, electric drill, electric guitar, electric eel. Oh. I mean, um, electric eels might work. It's beef. Depends on which farm. You animal. know what my next question is, right? Is this your final answer? It's my final yep. answer. That's my final answer. Oh, you have given your final answer. You got it right. It's <laughs> time to move on to a new question. Mike Tyson is controversial figure in which sport? Boxing. Final answer. You seem to be convinced, but is this your final answer? No. That's my final answer. 
the choice is made. That's the one. Okay, well done. Yet well done, right mate. Answer for me. Our team of editors offers you a new question. Who played Belle in the 2017 live action? Emma Watson. Right answer is C. Final answer? You sure? Oh, yes, that's my final answer. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. Well, Why would I watch that? You got it. First of all, oh, I, I never said I watched it. That question. I did watch it, but I never said I it's did. Time and you don't have to, to know question. that it was Emma Watson. I watched it because Beauty and the Beast was my favorite movie as a kid. The Disney version. The Eagles. Which expression describes something that has happened before? Is this deja vu? I just been in this place before. And what will be your final answer? That will be my final answer. If this is your final answer. Let's hope it's the correct answer. That's what we were looking for. That's right. Yeah! <laughs> I'm amazing! New question coming up. Good luck to you. What is the best policy according to the traditional proverb? Well, now... Uh, I don't actually know this. Uh, I feel like I should know this, but I don't know this. I mean, I, it makes sense that modesty, uh, modesty makes sense to me. But which question is this? Five hundred dollar question. So it's probably something that sticks out right away. Uh, it could also be honesty, but I mean, I'm pretty sure it's modesty. I don't think I should waste a lifeline on this. Nah, I'm gonna go with modesty. Well, let's go for D. And now to the most important question of all: Is this what? I'm not trolling. <laughs> it could have been honesty. I don't know. That's my final answer. I had to make sure. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct answer. <sighs> I have oh my god, all the in yeah. chat. Sorry. Red oh, chat. Okay. Oh, cheating. Like that, to the, uh, oh. We had to play the card of chat at all. Come on. Now you leave with nothing. Fucking I'm innocence. sorry for you. Okay, I could have been honesty, and it was honesty, so I was not wrong, right? I was not wrong. Alright, that was unlucky. I, I should have used a lifeline. I should have used a 50-50 there. I should use the 50-50. Alright, hang. Don't let me down again, or you'll be out. Alright. Alright. I'm saving. Uh, we gotta go for the million, alright? We can't use the lifelines that early, but, you know, I should have maybe used a 50 Alright, we'll see. Welcome to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Are you ready to play today? Okay, let's go. Hang is going to have a ball tonight and try to play with no lifelines. <laughs> nah, I'm kidding. Good luck, here we go. Well, you know the money ladder. 15 questions and at the top, the million. To help you, you have four lifelines at your disposal. Phone a friend, the 50-50, ask the audience and flip the question. 
So let's move on to a whole new question. Which term describes meat that is easy to cut and eat? Uh, tender. No doubt. I know you are waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. Is this your final answer? Final answer. You make it look easy. All right, I'm playing serious now. Oh, I just had to answer that. <clears throat> Which of these is an informal term for a casino slot machine? A one-armed bandit. Well, I'd say final D. answer. You yes, absolutely. Obviously, that was the right answer. Are you ready for this new question? Who's behind the army of clones created on Camino for the Republic? Count Duco. Wait, F for the Republic? Yeah, and then it turns out to be the villain. Yeah. No, it's definitely Definitely A. a. Is that your f Wait, it's the wrong Wait what? Is it not Count no Duco? Way. I Wait. can't lose at this level of the game. I would never have bet on such a quick end. How sad. Uh, hey. uh, okay, 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 okay. Okay, okay. Clones, not droids. Yeah, I in my head. Yeah. My bad. I mix it up in my head. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I I mixed it up in my head. They were clones, droids. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. All right. Hang sucks. Shun is much better. 47. Alright. That was my bad. I uh, I messed up. I messed up. I, I didn't read the question properly. I just answered fast because it was the early-ish question. So. Uh. Welcome back to... Alright. What is the name of the platform that Disney launched? To compete with Netflix in November, uh, Disney Plus. Hmm. Okay. Final answer. B. Final answer. You sure? I'm you sure. Time, sure about it. Disney right. percentage. We're Disney now minus. Close to the threshold that I wanted to reach. Disney minus. This 20. new question shouldn't give you a hard time, in theory. What animated movie is the live-action movie Maleficent based on? It's based on... Uh, no, no, uh, no, and... Yes, Sleeping Beauty. I forgot the name. D for me, please. D yes, for me, absolutely. please. So let's move on to a whole new question. Which bear has a friend called Bill Badger? I don't know. Bill Badger. Oh, Badger from uh, Winnie the Pooh, I'm assuming. Question. Is he called Bill, first name? Bill Badger? In Swedish, he's just called Badger, I think. No, 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 he's called Gösta Grävling. Grävling means Badger. So that that must be a B for the Badger in English. It's C, no All doubt. Right. Bill the Badger. I know you are waiting for me to ask you. Has to be. So it let's has to go. Be. Is this your final answer? That's my final answer. You have made your choice. What? Who the fuck is Rupert? This is the Who is Rupert? And why is what is the badger called in Winnie the Pooh then? I'm really disappointed with my performance. What is he called? Unfortunately, it's all over. How sad. Oh, yes, the guy is not from Winnie the Pooh. Oh, shit. Who the fuck is just like that? Link? Hang on, I got gigabated by something. Oh my god, dude, this is some real old school. 
Uh, yeah, the the, the the new new Swedish friends don't even know about this shit. This is some real furry shit. Look at this. Shit. This is some real furry shit, man. Kid show. All right, that was unlucky. That was unlucky. I got baited, but I don't know who Rupert is. Who the fuck is Rupert, man? Who is Rupert? I have never heard of a bear called Rupert. I thought that was a Zelda currency, huh? Pablo, this guys. I need, to, I need to calm, calm myself, use the lifelines if I don't know, alright. If I'm if I'm not 90% sure, use the lifeline. Unless... In which country can you see the pyramids? In Egypt. I'm 90% sure, at least. I would stake my life on it. Or whatever it That's means. my final answer. Drew Boy Baxter with the Prime Sub uh, Mythic in the CR Raven this is your Dodge. Final answer, Thank you, boys. Welcome back. Let's well. hope it's the correct answer. You make it look easy. You got it. That just goes to show that my memory is still in good shape. You hear that, chat? Trust yourself God and your answers for this new question. What name of the Bambi's best rabbit friend? Well, I know what it's called in Swedish. I forgot what it's called in Swedish. Uh, I think it's C, but... I mean, he's stamping his foot, right? I think, but that could also be a tapper, right? Uh... I mean, I should definitely just gamble here, right? I don't need some weight. Hundred dollar, two hundred dollar question. I just you can see, right? Okay. I see. am not ninety percent, but it's question, sure. it's, question I, it's question two. It's question two. Yes? It's question two. It's question two. That's my final answer. It's stump in Swedish, I think. So it should be. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. Wait. I have to announce to you that this is not the right answer. Sorry. Oh, well. I'm getting baited by the Swedish names all the time, man. Okay, that I no regrets on that. All right, $200 question. I'm not using my lifeline until at least 500, all right? No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, no. no, no. That if I can all right, now we're now we're playing serious here. All right, we're, we're going for the million. We're going for the million. There are language rules for translation. Let's Just look up Thumper Room Thirty Four. I already did. In a familiar phrase, which letter marks the spot to refer X marks the spot? Uh, I would say B. I have no doubt. Final? Final. Yes, that's my final. Yes, you are right. Well, I think we all agree that we can move on to this new question. In which method of egg preparation are the eggs beaten before being cooked? Uh, in poached scrambled in scrambled eggs okay it's d i think final answer 100 percent so well done you got it see experienced contestants always win the day and i'm about to win the day let's go for this new eliminatory question which of these sports is not part of alpine skiing
Okay, I know all of these except for Pursuit. Pursuit. Uh, giant Slalom. We have Slalom. Downhill is Stutlop, I believe. Which is just as fast as possible down the slope. And Pursuit, I don't know what that is. So that must be the one that's not part of Alpine Skiing. I feel like since I'm 100% sure these are included, or 90% sure these are all, I should pick this. It's D, I think. Well, actually, I'm sure of it. Are you absolutely sure? Is that your final answer? That'll be my final answer. If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. Ah! But the only sports are right. sweets are good at. Oh, what okay. A New question coming up. Good luck to you. Which brother and sister do I had a hit with the song Close to You? Uh. Hmm. Carpenters sounds the most likely, but I'm going to ask for a new question. You want to use the you want to use the question swap as early as possible. Choose to use your flip lifeline. Because the questions are easier earlier on. Ah shit. I think we all agree that we can move on to this new question. Who would most likely use a scalpel in their daily work? Throwing. Throwing a lifeline for nothing. It's D. D. I think. Sergeant. I I'm choosing D. And well done. You've got it. That just go. So let's move on to a whole new question. Ciao is a greeting in which language? It's a Italiano. Italiano. I'm gonna try B. Fine. You got to that threshold, Ooh. so you are in good shape. Hey, Mushroom Kingdom, here we go. Are you ready for this new question? Which character says the force is strong with this one in 1977's Star Wars? Uh. Let me think here. Uh, one of these two, a hundred percent. I mean, I don't want to get baited. Like, I, my first would be Obi Wan, but the more I'm thinking about the question, I'm thinking uh, Darth Vader. Uh. I'm 90% sure now it's Darth Vader. Uh, I just want to... I'm just going back in the movie to see where exactly where he would say it. He's talking about Luke Skywalker. Whoever it is is talking about Luke Skywalker. And he's talking I cannot remember when they say it. I'm going to use the fifty fifty. Okay, let's take Unfortunately, away two incorrect answers. I want to uh, we are left with. not get eliminated here. Voice recognition, shit. The yeah. force is strong with this one. <laughs> I'm gonna say A. A. Is that your final answer? Um, that's my final answer. You have made your choice. Ah, I'm 
by a bridge. I was thinking don't wait at 90%, and then you baited me. Man, this guy. Didn't see that coming. You are leaving with your guaranteed cash prize. You played a good game. I was 90% sure it was Darth Vader, and then he said the the TTS with Obi-Wan voice. Alright, that's unfair, man. That is unfair. First, I lose the 50-50, and then I lose the 50-50 again. I lost the 75% chance. Huh? That's bullshit, I'll be honest. Uh, that's, uh, that's fucking bullshit. Shit, man. No donations when I'm it's thinking. To move oh. on to a new question. Which color is not on Superman's costume? Definitely no green. I would say D, obviously. You had to make you really know your Which of these series was not created by Joss Whedon? Who is Joss Whedon? Apparently the guy who made all of these. So Angel is the spin-off of Buffy the Vampire Slayer. It's the super straight vampire sparkling before Twilight was a thing. Uh, Firefly. I have started watching because everyone said it's so good and then it's not that great. Stargate I've seen a little here and there because I'm a boomer but I never actually watched the whole show. So assuming that uh, two of these uh, is from the same creator. Uh, only one of these are not and Firefly Stargate I'm gonna say that Stargate is not created because Stargate uh, aesthetics are no no never mind I go back Stargate is actually fairly similar to Buffy the Vampire Slayer in how the shows are made Firefly even though I didn't watch the whole thing I want to watch an episode feels different so I'm gonna say Firefly was not created See, by Joss Whedon. No doubt about it. And now to the most important question of all: Is this your final answer? What? Yes, that's my final answer. I'm not a fan of any of these. Do you mean? If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. Fuck! Can't always win. That's the wrong answer. Sorry. Uh, well, well. Uh, fucking shit. Yeah, as you know, uh, like you know the fucking names of the directors of these boomer shows. How huh? you weren't even born, Chad? I don't want to hear it from you. Shut the fuck up. All right, you were literally not born when these shows released. Any of them, okay? Literally. So shut your fucking mouth. With your sumer shit. Alright, this time for sure. Which famous carnival phenomenon, phen phenomenon uh, did David Lynch take an interest in? Uh... The bearded woman. I would say D, obviously. Final? Oh no, you were so close. Who the fuck oh, is this wow. and who is the elephant Great. man? What a failure. I'm not proud of myself. Oh no, I'm so sorry. It was a pleasure to meet you. How is it? Okay, how is this the hundred? Okay, whatever. Why is this the hundred dollar question? Why this 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 hundred dollar question? Uh, that's not a hundred dollar question. Hundred dollar questions should be super giga obvious. All right. Uh, it's not. It shouldn't be easy. All right. It shouldn't be easy. It shouldn't be uh eighty percent. It should be a hundred percent. All right. Oh, no. 
This is 100%, alright? Uh... Oh my god. Wait. Okay. Hang on. You never really think about the names. I mean, I know... Like, Diana Prince... Is 90%. But why is she called Prince on an Amazon female-only island? I'm gonna say A. That's so weird. Are you sure? That's my final answer. You pulled it off. No, I knew. I knew it was Diana Prince, 90%, and I was about to take it, and then I started thinking, why is she called Prince on a feminist Amazon island? I have never thought the thought ever before in my life, and I just now thought of it. Why? Oh, um... Because her mother is a queen? Yeah, shouldn't she be a princess then? What is your point? That's stupid. Who played Steve Trevor in the movies Wonder Woman? And <laughs> what the fuck? I don't know this. I haven't actually watched... Wait. Oh, no. These are the new movies. Oh, sorry. My bad. Uh, who played Steve Trevor? I... I haven't watched the 1984 one because it got such shit reviews. I didn't even bother. Wonder Woman, I watched. I don't remember who Steve Trevor was, but probably the guy. Chris Hemsworth is uh, the uh, the Thor guy. Uh, uh, but that is Marvel. I don't think he has a role in DC then. Chris Evans uh, sounds familiar. I think he's the fairly skinny guy. Uh, I don't I don't remember who this character is in the show. I don't know. What question is this? 200! Shit movies, man. I'm gonna go Let's with Chris go with Evans. A. So this is your final answer? Oh, I, don't, I don't remember gosh, how he looks like. I don't remember how the male guy answer. looks like even. I don't even remember. All so how can I know? Find out the right answer together. Oh no, you were so close. Well, well, the old geezer messed up again. What a shame. You're leaving with nothing at all. Yeah, I don't even remember Thanks he was in the movie. Good luck to you. Oh. Oh, but Chris Evans is Captain America. Uh, yeah. That, sorry. That was, that was not a good guess regardless. Ah, I, I thought I thought of another name, bro. I don't fucking remember every single Hollywood fucking name, man. Marvel is shit. All right, Marvel is shit. Fucking shit. All right. Yeah, I know Wonder Woman is DC, alright? I was referring to the fucking actor names of Marvel characters, alright? On pairs of trousers, what name is given to the front opening, uh, flies? It's D, I think. I I'm choosing D. Spiders. Is that your final? Yes. That is correct. Your new... <laughs> the star of the 2002 action film XXX was Vin Diesel. Let's go with A. Are you absolutely Classic. sure? That it Triple X. What spice question. is used in speculos? 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 I don't know what that is. Speculos? Speculos? Let's think. 
I actually don't know what this <sighs> this dish is. Speculos? I'm gonna refresh the question. Because I have no idea what this is. Uh I actually can't even guess. You what is it? Flip. It's a tough choice. Good luck. Ginger. It's a biscuit. I never I don't need sugar, so. I think we all agree that we can move on to this new question. What is the city of City Bo said located? Said. City Bo Said. City Bo Said. What the fuck are these? This is this kid. This is not a three hundred dollar question, man. What is? Well, uh, Said sounds very Arabic, so I'm thinking not Egypt for sure. Uh, yeah, did I? Awesome, you should consider getting your money back from Mensa because they clearly added a zero to your actual IQ of 14. Holy shit, this is Bidder Mart Sen all over again. It's now up to the audience to choose what they think is the right answer. Good luck. Imagine thinking useless knowledge uh, has anything to do with uh, intelligence. Tunisia. I would say B. I have no doubt. Is that your final answer? Um, that's my final answer. Yes, right, geography is fucking find useless. Out the right answer together. You make it look easy. You got it's it. literally useless. It's literally See, useless. Experienced all right. contestants always win the day. Our team of editors offers you a new question. All right. In which British city did the Beatles begin their musical careers? I don't know. Uh, not London. Liverpool. I never... Glasgow, Swansea, Liverpool. I don't know. So I am going to call somebody that I used to By know. Calling someone, you may be making I call my my wife. Because she's 72 and her name is Zelda. Yes, hello. I'm listening. Good evening. This is Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? And Pablo needs your wisdom. Well, I'm going to do I don't know where to fight this time. Zelda, you're my last hope on this one. But don't put too much pressure on yourself, okay? Not too much. It's C. No doubts whatsoever. No doubt. That's what I would have guessed. But it's C, right? It would have been pretty okay. much a C. one in three. Final? That's my final answer. You have given your final answer. Now is the time to see the right one. No doubt about it. Yes. You okay. Are right. Hey, Joe Dots, even 100 months. Fake 100 months anniversary. Fake 100 months, indeed. But thank you. I go and back. So let's move on to a whole new question. Which of these Dursley family members does not exist? Vernon is the dad. Dudley is the son. Petunia is the mother. So, I guess Dolores. C. Not a fake fan! And now to the most important question of all. Hey! <laughs> What's up? Final answer. Um, that's my final answer. That's right. If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. The threshold has been reached. Congratulations! Yes, sir. Your new question is ready. Good luck. Which country has a naval base in Guantanamo Bay in Cuba? And 
the United States uh, and uh, several uh yeah hey I'm just gonna go in I'm gonna try be I like I don't want to confuse myself here so let's go with Mexico somehow I don't know answer? yes that's my final answer yeah all right, let's find out the right answer together. That's Oof. what we were looking for. That's right. That just goes to show that my memory is still in good shape. It was there. You will be asked a new question now. Now! Which of these is a play by Russian writer Anton Chekhov? Russian writer Anton Chekhov. Three mothers. All right, let's think about this logically because we only have a 50 50 remaining. Three uh, mothers doesn't make any sense. Three fathers could be a funny uh, scenario for when you don't know who the father is, I guess. Uh, Three brothers, three sisters. Probably not three sisters, probably not three mothers. If I had to guess, three fathers, but I'm gonna do 50-50 uh, and pick whichever of these two answers. remains. Alright. I have not seen it, obviously. so uh, I don't know. A Ruski place, um, yes. That's my final answer. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. Ah uh, shit! Fucking oh, no. shit! So close. Well, well, the old geezer messed up again. Congratulations. <sighs> You walk away with your guaranteed cash prize. Good for you. Good for you. Shit, man. Anton Shikiv. As if you've seen this play, man. You haven't seen shit, alright? Uh, you just Google everything and then you pretend you're smart. Fucking chat, man. Hey, fuck, I am on to you. I'm Margaret. She's 69 years old. Nice. She likes mini golf. I have because I'm an action boomer, unlike you. Good luck. Pizza dough is made of water, salt, yeast, and Flower. Uh, I'm choosing B. And what will be your final sugar. answer? Sugar. Yes. Just own it. You hey, got it. Pizza pasta. What's that in? Physically and mentally. Are you, you can ready tell. for this new question? The U.S. dollar sign is which letter of the alphabet in with a vertical line through it? The S. A choice has to be made, so we're going to say D. D. I know you are it waiting. It do for me be to like ask that. You. So let's go. Is that is good. our team of editors offers you a Who new was question. the Roman god of love? Well, Cupid shot arrows uh, into people's uh, buttholes, I guess. Well, I'm going to try A. Are you sure? That's my final answer. That is the right answer. Nice. Your new question is ready. Good luck. Who has never played Superman in a movie? Definitely Mel Gibson. Definitely. I'm choosing A. You had to make a choice. Is that your final answer? Um, 
and that's my final answer. Krypton forever. You made your choice. You took your time, but you are right. And boom, one more answer. Ha ha. All right, I told you I would play serious. You Here question is. coming up. Good luck to you. Which of these has windows? One open on each day of the season after it is named. What? Which of these has windows? One open on each day of the season after which it is named. Oh. What? I can't. I'm rereading this fucking. Okay, it's an advent calendar. That's in December. That's 24 days before Christmas. Uh. Which of these has windows? One opened on each day of the season after which it is named. These are not seasons. Um, okay, a choice what? has to be made. The I'm fuck? To this is such an cancer question to read, right? Oh, yes, that's my final answer. Is it not? A, is it not a Question the read. choice is made. It brain fucked me. threshold has been reached. Congratulations. Woo! And let's go for a whole new question. Have I used the lifeline yet? Uh, which of these is Bill Nye's character in Pirates of the Caribbean? Dead Man's Chest. Bill Nye. I believe it's D. Uh, uh, Davy Wait, Jones. C seems good to me. Okay, C. You know what my next question is, right? Davy Jones locker. That will be my final answer. Okay, the computer validated your answer. That's what we were looking for. That's right. Ah, uh, is it? We're getting a million. I feel a million chat. Physically and mentally, you can tell. Will you be able to answer this new question as well? What planet does Luke Skywalker take refuge in Star Wars Episode 7 The Force Awakens? Episode 7, so the when he's uh when he's old, Luke Skywalker. Uh I have no idea. My first instinct is uh, A, but I it would just be a fart in the dark. I'm going to uh, actually refresh the question. I think. Yeah. Let's flip the question right now, hoping that the new one will bring you luck. Achoo! Achoo! Nope. The game is getting tougher now with this brand new question. In the Bible, what was the name of John the Baptist's mother? I want to say B or C. Uh, not C. I want to say B. Elizabeth is such a UK name though. Doesn't make sense. I guess. The equivalent, the American find it in the Bible. Wasn't this the prostitute or am I just thinking about a specific song? Uh, 
I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, let the audience decide this one because you decided to appeal to the audience, who will vote now to help you. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, okay. Let's do it. And too bad if I'm wrong. Is that your final answer? Yes, that's my final answer. Don't debate. This is your final answer. Let's hope it's the correct answer. Yes, you are right. <laughs> that almost drove me crazy. All right, we had to use the lifeline, but uh, answer this new question as well. In which city does Miss Daisy live in the movie Driving Miss Daisy? I honestly don't remember. Uh, I would assume that she lives in Orlando or Atlanta. Almost certainly. So I'm gonna give it a 50-50. Okay, we will take two incorrect answers away. I go with Atlanta. Well, I'm going to try A. And now to the most important question of all. Is this your final answer? I don't answer? remember. This That's is such a long answer. time ago. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct answer. Just oh my god! Oh my god! <sighs> Margaret is still pretty resourceful, you see? That's right, the god gamer prevails. I hope you have recovered from your emotions because here is your new question. In Blowout, what sound is the film's director trying to obtain? What? I'm too stressed out. I have to calm down. I don't even get the question. I don't remember this. What in blow up? What sound okay, is the film let's get back the director to it. trying to obtain? I don't know what movie this is. What, what, why would he try to obtain a sound? A woman scream? A gunshot? I mean, it's not... It's not hard to, to get a gunshot sound. It's not hard to get a woman scream. Car accident probably is the answer, but I don't fucking know. It's certainly better to be alone than in bad company, but this time... Your friend will be important. We'll call him right away. And uh, my daughter Astrid. Hello, yes? Good evening. Good evening, Astrid. I need your guiding light to help me choose the right answer. Uh, well, I hope I have the enlightenment that will allow you to answer this question correctly. <laughs> it's a, I believe. Yeah, I'm gonna say A. Well, she seems fairly confident, at least. I'm gonna go with A. a. Final answer? You sure? Scream! Scream! That's my final answer. Is that blowout? Scream! Ah! All right, let's find out the right answer <laughs> together. <laughs> well done. Hey. You got it. Oh, but no, you don't really need to Woo! scare me like that, 16, okay? 16,000. Will you Cared by a five-year-old? You think her daughter is five years old? That would be, uh... The S40, V40s, V70, and C70 are models from which car company? Uh, Volvo. I thought about it a lot, and I'm going to say C. Classic. Is that your Even I know answer? that. Um, 
that's my final answer. Brrr. The choice is made. This money is safe. Now. Woo! Thanks for the threat. Let's go. We're winning the million. Easy peasy. This new question is now waiting for you to be answered with flying colors. In which 1970s sci-fi film did Sandman terminate runners? Uh, Mad Max? Oh, um. Were they called Sandman? Hmm. I remember some rollerball by the way also really old movie but i don't know if that was the movie i'm just gonna go with mad max okay see i know you are waiting for me to ask you so let's go is this your final answer yes that's my final oh shit they get trapped is it rollerball you have made your i think i've seen this movie like really brutal no okay this is the wrong answer shit i don't know what logan's run is really badly uh, I'm oh, looking at that was the wrong answer. But the good news is Fuck. you are walking. Yeah, the rollerball is the movie I thought it was. Cash prize. I got baited, but I wouldn't have guessed Logan's Logan's run because I don't know it. Shit in my ass. Minus thirty two K Ah minus thirty one nine. Yeah, who walks away with the money, dude? Like, what? That's uh, Alright, we're getting the million. We're getting the million. Alright, I'm getting a million. We need a new character. She sucks dick. 50 years ago. Ruben, 29, consultant, fashion. Maybe he should consult a fashionista. First. Which of these phrases describes a miser mis miserly person? I'm lost. I'm lost. I'm guessing this is the only phrase I I know. So miserly is a word I don't know. We're choosing A. So this is your final answer. That's the one. That's the one. New question coming up. Good luck to you. What is the name of the thoroughfare uh, on which the New York Stock Exchange is situated? Bank Road, Profit Parkway. Uh, let's go with B. Let's go with B, shall we? Wall Street. The best contestant is on his way, ladies and gentlemen. Ah. Ah. Let's go for a whole new question. Which of these names is not a shortened form of Richard? Rick, Chuck, Dicky, Rich. Well, I would assume it's Chuck. But let's not haste ourselves here. Uh, it's the only one that makes sense. Going to choose B. No, Dicky is most not important the question of all. Dick. Is this your final answer? Well, yes, that's my final answer. The Dick. choice is made. It's time to discover the right answer. That yes. is the right answer. And a right answer Shuck. for the coolest contestant. Bam. So let's move on to a whole new question. In the rhyme, what does Jack Horner retrieve with his thumb while eating his Christmas pie? Bro, what is this, UK fucking rhymes or some shit? Hmm. In the rhyme, what does Jack Horner retrieve with his thumb while eating his Christmas pie? Uh,
I mean, definitely not a blackbird. Uh, plum doesn't make any sense. Ring. He retrieves his ring. Key. Key. A key to where? Ring probably is the answer. But fuck if I know, man. 50-50 on this bitch, maybe? Okay. Yeah, 50-50 on this bitch. Alright, nice. Well, plum and thumb kinda rhyme, so Let's I guess I should have thought of that. <laughs> Let's save some time. Final answer? That you was sure? a waste. That's my final answer. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct Fuck. answer. That's the one. Unlucky. The best contestant is on his way, ladies and gentlemen. This new question shouldn't give you a hard time. In Popcorn theory. is traditionally made from which grain? Corn. Mace. Mace. Amazing. No doubts whatsoever, obviously. And now to the most important question of all. Is this your final answer? Well. You've reached that question. Yes. Money is safe. Now, who's chat? You, not me. Uh, there's too much noise. I'm which, having trouble focusing. Uh, which of these is a former British Prime Minister? John Captain, John Admiral, John Sergeant, John Major. I mean, I'm gonna refresh the question. John Major, I would have guessed, but let's flip the question right now, hoping that the new one will bring you luck. Fuck. So let's move on to a whole new question. Which of these is a soft, gentle breeze? A uh, zephyr is... A... Okay, wait. So, zephyr has something to do with wind, for sure. But it's not a gentle breeze, is it? A zeppelin is an aircraft. Zodiac is a Zodiac and a Sinfandel I don't know what that is but I know this is this is like a like a wind thingy uh, so either this is a this is but this is not a, a, a soft gentle breeze because in TFT there's a weapon called Zephyr right and then you cyclone uh, an opponent for a long time. And that's not something that can be done with a gentle breeze. So I'm gonna go with a Sinfandel. And uh, if uh, it is Zephyr, then I'm gonna it's complain so at the TFT devs. No taking risks. Next what annual meeting. Final answer? That's my final answer. You have given your that's final wine. answer. I hope it is the right one. Fucking shit! Fucking shit, Debs, huh? Tornado? Is that a soft, gentle breeze? Huh? That's the opposite! I got baited by TFT, Debs, I'm gonna be honest. Ah, uh, that doesn't count, man. I got baited by TFT, Debs. It's. Alright. Um, I thought they would be, you know, uh, making rational uh, names, you know? Uh, apparently not. Uh, that, was, that was not my fault, that was on the TFT devs, alright.
I went into my memory bank and found Zephyr in my vocabulary, but it was wrong. What is Obi Wan's uh, Obi Wan Kenobi's master's name? It is Quigon Quigon Jin. Of course, it's D. Of Anyone course. else in my place would know it. And now to the most important. You took your time, but you are right. The best contestant is on his way, ladies and gentlemen. Ah. Ah. And let's go for a whole new question. Charles Dickens wrote the novel titled Oliver What? Twist. Twist and shake. Please, sir, may I have Please some more? Truly. You had to make a choice. Room meow meow with Paris of Welcome, Old Dolb, Kayseri, More Tremor, um, J Fly, Samotka, Super Saber, ACDZ Young Fan. Thank you, boys, for coming back. Welcome. Okay, the computer. That yeah. is the right answer. The handsomest and the most cultured. <laughs> what more could you want? Your new question is ready. Good luck. Complete the title of the Arctic Monkeys hit single. I bet you look good on the dance floor. I bet you look good on the beach. Oh, um. Uh. On the TV. Let's go for C. <laughs> Let's save some time. On the tennis court. Are you absolutely sure. Is that your final answer? That will be my final. Oh shit. Uh, the... Now it's time to find out the correct answer. And unfortunately, oh. this wow, is everyone's the wrong answer. The... It's the end for you. Yes, but the questions were also too hard. It's the wrong answer. Everyone's spamming really D. Sorry, it was D. Nothing. Nice one. Alright, I wasn't playing serious there though because uh, I got distracted. Alright. Right. This time for sure. Ruben is shit. Alright, we're going with Lindsay. She's a researcher and she loves cinema. Even in the current year. Alright, we're getting one million. No, but I'm sure that I have what does a team captain wear to stand out from his team members on the field? A hat, a scarf, an armband, a mask. I think he has an armband. You have to tempt fate sometimes. Okay, see. Finally, that's the yeah. one. Let's go for a whole new. <laughs> uh, what does IOC mean? International Olympic Committee, International Organization of Challengers, Industrial Order of Champions, Invitational for Orlando Competitors. I mean, I guess it's the Olympic Committee. Hey, like, I have no doubt. Is that your final answer? That will be my final. You all pulled right. it off. All right, all right. New question. Where do Harry Potter and Ron Weasley meet for the first time? Where do they meet for the first time? Uh, they meet at uh, King's Cross Station. I would say A. You had to make a choice. Is that your Because uh, it's answer? the mother that teaches them how yes, to run through the thing, answer. right? So they already met before the Hogwarts All Express. Right, let's find out the right answer together. Wait. No. Just yeah. Okay. It. You got Ooh. it. Perfectly executed. Fake fan awesome. they spam. Ah, they thought it was on the train. Your, new your bots. Your bots. Don't talk to me about Harry Potter. You're the fake fans. Huh? A tremor is a small avalanche. Uh, earthquake. Final answer. Sometimes you have to take a chance. 
Okay. Take a chance Thanks. on the. Is that your final answer? Take a chance on me. That's my final answer. You have given. That's an answer I can get behind. Well, that was a really close call. Phew. Phew. Here's a new Phew. question for you. Which part, which body part has Aquaman already lost? What? Which body part has Aquaman already lost? What do you mean has lost? Aquaman? What? When the fuck did he lose this? Is this some new friend Aquaman shit I don't know about? What the fuck is this? He hasn't lost any. Uh, I'm very confused. Which body part has Aquaman already lost? Has he lost his foot? No, he hasn't fucking lost his foot. He hasn't lost his hand. He hasn't lost his shoulder. He hasn't lost his head. What? Uh, this is illegal. What is this new friend shit? I haven't seen this latest Aquaman movie. Is that why? They, there's no way they can base it on... What? They wouldn't say already lost. They would say which body part does he lose or some shit in the latest movie. Already lost. Ah, uh, this is illegal. I have to... I have to... I have to swap the question, man. Because this is so stupid. By using the flip, you decided to be wise. What? He had a hook. Your new question is ready. When the Good fuck luck. did he replace his hand with a hook? When? When? He lost it in cartoon and comics. What? 30 years ago, 1998. Bro. Who, like, who read Aquaman? What the fuck, man? In chess, which is the only piece that can be put into check? The king. I would say C. Final answer. So this is your final answer? Yes, yeah, that's my final answer. Aquaman, Aquaman is, is the answer, worst fucking let's DC. Let's hope it's the correct right answer. The threshold has been reached. He's so fucking bad, they had to completely remake him for the new movies with the Hawaiian guy. Like, completely chat him up because he was so fucking bad in the early on. If you take back something you said, you are said to eat your words. I believe in my gut and How is this a harder question I'm than Aquaman? What the I know you fuck? are waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. Is this your final answer? That is my final oh. answer. Yes, that's my final answer. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. Well done. You got it. Baby, you've got it. What nationality was the explorer Vasco da Gama? He was uh, Portuguese. I'm sure that it's B. Okay, we have faith. You had to make a choice. Is I that your final answer? I'm 90% sure, um, so I'm not going to waste that time. That's timeline. my final answer. The choice is made. Just yeah. hold it. You got it. Perfectly executed. Perfectly splendid. Concentrate. Here's a new question for you. In Japanese costume, what is an obi? Obi wan. Ah. Uh, Japanese costume. What is an obi? 
sandal, sash, robe, hat. Okay. We don't know, but what we do know is that Obi-Wan is a character, and he's wearing a robe, but he's also wearing a sash with the robes. Uh, all Jedi's wear robes though, so why would he be called Obi-Wan? Uh... Oh, hello, for son, for sin here is the million dollar question. Yeah. For son, what is the best in Martin chat? Is it A? So no. Is it B? So no. Is it C? Holiday Santa, or is it D, Vivan? B, Frumel. That's right, it is B, Frumel. Ah. Embrace Frumel. Ah, uh, okay, I think it's Sash or Robe based on Obi Wan. Uh, do I have 50 50? I have 50 50. Alright, I'll take a leak though. I'm not gonna Google, okay? I just have to take a I'm not looking at chat. Okay. Uh, um, uh, okay. Let's think about this. We are at 4,000. We have only used one lifeline. Hello, for sin. Congratulations on winning my one million Mozambique dollars. Anyways, chat, as always, remember, the Zoom emote is very odd and shit. The best emote now is Fumo. Embrace Fumo. Reject Zoom-o. Fumo, 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 Okay. Uh, he's also wearing sandals, is he not? He's wearing everything but a hat. Actually, now that I think about it. I feel like this is a 50-50 question rather than one of these. Uh... The only only ones. No. Uh, 
All right, I'm taking the I'm taking the audience. audience. Okay, audience. audience. This question is worth a good prize. I would have probably said the uh, sash. I'm going to bet on B. You know what my next question is, right? Is Wasted. this your final answer? Oh, yes. That's my final answer. Okay, the computer validated your answer. You got it right. Well done. Calm and serenity are the recipe for success. No. Will you be able to answer this new question as well? What is the nationality of Mujik Boiki Park, the artist of the manga Dr. Stone? <sighs> Mujik Park. Mujik Park. Um, it doesn't sound very Chinese, I'm gonna be honest with you. It doesn't sound very Japanese either. So, my guess would be South Korean or Filipino. I know that South Korean likes to have a lot of parks in their name, right? Peter Park. I'm gonna go with South Korean. I don't think I should waste a 50-50 like, here. It's one of these two, I'm pretty sure. Park. Could be Filipino too, I guess. But... I could actually be Filipino. Uh, nah, don't waste it. Two more. We have to reach a million. You have to save it. Go South Korean. I believe in my gut and I'm choosing B. Park is well, almost so always choose. Korean. Yeah, that's is what that I thought too. Final answer? Um that's my final answer. The choice is made. It's time to discover the right answer. That easy, easy. Answer. It might have been thing for three years. Enjoy the badge. Zulu is this. Brass, Rory, and LMEO. Welcome back. Welcome. And here's a new question that I hope won't worry you. Doesn't worry me. Which of these is another term for castle for a castle in chess? Uh, wait, I am confused now. Which of these is another term for a castle in chess? So castle is when you switch the rook and the king. Uh, but rook is already a piece. But the rook looks like a castle. So rook has to be a bait move here. It has to be a bait move. So... I'm looking at... A or C... Um, wow. I can't believe they would put this in there to bait like this, right? It has to be bait. I 50-50 won't help me if they remove the rook and something else. But if they keep the rook, then I will pick whatever is not. So they might keep the rook. Because they might want to bait people like that. I'm gonna go 50-50. Okay, please take away two random wrong answers and leave the correct answer and the one remaining wrong answer. All right. I'm picking. You have to tempt fate sometimes. Okay. See. I know you are waiting for me to ask you, so let's go. Is this your final answer? That will be my final answer. To castle does not equal castle. You have made your choice. What? It's the wrong Are they actually talking about the piece? Well, it's no big deal. I still had a good time. What? Nice shot. Respect for playing the game. 
It was really fun playing with you. Great player. Are you fucking serious? Who calls it a castle, man? Oh yeah, you can call it a castle, but when I call the knight a horse, then I'm... What the fuck? No. Man. No, no, no. They, that, that is too... Wait, does any actual chess player call it a castle? Are you kidding me? Never! They call it a rook every single time! What? They mean which piece looks like a castle? No, that's not what the question said. The term castle, which is when you are castling. The term castle. To castle is the word, is the phrase. To castle. Huh? They're baiting me. To castle. Wait, what was the question? It said a castle. So it, it said the term a castle. Did it say that? It's the old word for it. In philosophy, Occam's razor is the problem solving principle that recommends searching for explanations constructed with the smallest and simplest possible set of elements. Okay, that cannot be implied when they try and bait you, alright? They put in Mad Max, Sandman and Runners, huh? Occam's Razor is not applicable here. When they literally try to make you lose with baits, okay? It's a fucking game show. They don't want you to win the one million. But the, their bait was not even a bait, it was even chat could solve it. It was just a fucking stupid shit. I picked crow because I was certain rook was a bait. I was certain they talked about castling because I had never heard uh, a fucking good chess player say call it castle instead of rook. <sighs> Which of these is a men's gymnastic discipline? Uh. I guess vault. Let's go for C. Is yes. I guess dungeon this of discipline is something else. Uh, blacksmith theory. works mainly with which substance? No, but that one's the right. Uh. Final answer. You sure? Let's I'm sure. See. Yeah. You really know your answers. So we would see. Offers you a new question. What name is given to the summer period when newspaper print very little serious news? Uh, oh, um. I don't actually know. Uh, definitely not Mad Month. Definitely not Slow Week. Definitely not. It could be either of these actually, but it's more like likely for it to be dull days than a whole season. I think it's the semester period in like July or some shit. I'm gonna go with all days. Yes, that's it. Is that your final answer? That's my final answer. You have made your choice. Fucking silly season. What are these UK Brexit terms? Is this a Brexit term? Huh? This is not American. What is this shit? That, uh, uh, because in America all news are silly at all times, right? That's how I know. That's he, I'll give you one more chance here, Mr. CEO, but after that you're fucking out of here. 
shit. Uh, in the chilling adventures of Sabrina, who is Sabrina? She's a witch. Yes. I'm gonna say B. B. And you pulled it up. All right. Your new question is no, but that how many corner question. posts are there on a field? Less. Uh, I guess four. Wait, corner posts. What sport is this? Because if it's like soccer or some shit. But those aren't corners, but maybe they count like midfield as one square, which would make it then six, right? Because there are shared corners, but I'm just gonna. Corner posts. Oh, wait! Corner post, is that where you do the. No. Hmm. I was gonna go with four. I, I mean, come B. on. Oh, oh comps racer, they you said. To be right? But is this your final answer? That's my final answer. That's oh. an answer I can get behind. Four is bait, they say in chat. Well -executed job. Your asshole is a bait. This new question shouldn't give you a hard time. What's who's the main character in the Gotham TV series? I think it was a castle. What do you mean, Mr. Force? Yes, it's a castle for sure. Yes, that's it. When did you hear final someone answer? said the word sure? pro playing chess, yes. you moron? That's my final answer. I never heard that any chess to player call the rook answer. a castle. Because a castle is the term where you switch the rook and the well king ish. Done. You got it. Good chess, motherfucker. I believed it to the end. I did a good job. It's time to move on to a new question. Which of these directors has not directed an X-Men movie? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna replace the question. The question I would have said inspiring you, and that one of is these. why you choose to use your flip lifeline. Well done. Okay. This new question shouldn't give you a hard time, in theory. I replace the question. In Roman mythology, who was the goddess of chance and fate? Duma. Fortuna I'm favors the ball, then. Is that your final answer? Look. <laughs> that will Look be at my him. final answer. Of course. It... In English, it's what is the German cake Schwarzwälder Kirschtort called? Schwarzwälder Kirschtort. Okay, so tort means cake uh, uh schwarz welder kirsch kirsch what is kirsch kirsch i recognize it i cherry it could be cherry actually uh uh schwarz welder Swatch is black, is it not? So black forest, welder, is that forest? Welder? Swatch? Swatch is black, I think. So it has to be black forest cake. But welder, I never... Where does the kirsch come in? But this is part is cake. Torte. So it has to be. I'm gonna go. And let's go for A. 
final. That's my final. Answer. Okay, the computer validated your answer. You got to the threshold. Is Kirsch then just a type of cake? Like it's just describing if it's like a round cake or if it's like a high cake or something. And let's go for a whole new. Oh, plan. Kirsch is cherry. Oh, okay. That's why I was confused with the cherry part. All right, bait. Which of these is not a traditional ingredient of a plowman's lunch? <laughs> Which of these is not a traditional ingredient of a plowman's lunch? Well, a plowman plowing your mom. What is a plowman? A plowman, is that one of those that go around with a scythe on the field? Is that a plowman? I think so. Right? Uh, and what would he not eat? I guess he would not eat ham. Because that's for rich people. Or some shit. Cheese is for rich people, maybe. Hmm. Well, I would say B or C. Uh, ham and cheese sandwich makes sense, but I don't think that would be a question then in this game. Uh, I think it's without B or C, almost certainly, but I cannot say which one. So I'm gonna go 50 50 on this. Okay, please take away two random wrong answers and leave the right answer and the one remaining wrong answer. Alright, so I'm guessing that uh, it's ham. I have a good hunch that it's C. Final answer? You sure? Um, that's my final answer. If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. You oh, know. I saw that chat. You all thought it was picked up, man. Well -executed job. Yeah, it doesn't make sense for it to be an actual ham and cheese sandwich, because that's too basic for it you to be, be like a, a new plowman's lunch or whatever. Had to be something. I could have just guessed ham to begin with. Which of these is the person elected by factory workers to deal with management? Uh, okay, it's either A or, or D. Um, I think it's, I think it's, I think it's D. I'm gonna go with D. I'm choosing D. Right away. It inspires confidence in me. Uh, is that your final answer? I think based on uh, what show was that? Answer. What show was that? Oh, the Wire. I can't wait With to the see Frank. the correct answer. See some whatever. That's an answer I can get behind. Uh, I believed it to the yeah. end. I did a good job. That <laughs> chat. I wouldn't look at your shit answers, alright? You're all wrong all the now time. That you've right? I am the god pressure, gamer. Why would I question. put my fate anywhere but in the light? Okay. Fix it, Felix was an animated character in what 2012 Disney film? Fix it, Felix. Okay. No, but that one's the right answer. Unless. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is a bait. Uh. I have not seen Brave Monsters University. Is that Monsters Inc. like three or some shit? I'm thinking it's Cars Two. The 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 guy with the the lifting crane thingy, majingi, the brown rundown car. Um. Yeah, it just makes sense. My I'm gonna fix. I'm gonna fix C. C. Okay, C. D is a bait. I know you are waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. Is this your final answer? That will be my final answer. If this is your final answer, 
Let's hope it's the correct answer. Uh... Oh what my god, dude. This is the wrong answer. What question was this? And why am I getting uh, baited? Not baited. An incredible run. I mean, Great game. I haven't seen this movie either, alright? I, I don't even know if I've seen Cars 2. Who has seen these new friends Zoomer shit, alright? All of you have seen all of these fucking movies because you're Zoomers, alright? I haven't seen any of these. Shit. 2012 is Zoomer, yes. 100%. 100% Zoomer, alright? Back in my days, we had Toy Story from Pixar. Why would they call it Wreck It Ralph, but Fix It Felix? Then it would be better if his name was Wreck It Winston. Or, I don't know, I know the name on W. What's the name on, the name on W? American. I don't know. Weasley. That's the last name. The, it was bait, alright? Uh, everyone who has not seen the movie would have thought it was bait. Alright, uh, there's Welcome no discussion in this chat. There's right, no discussion. Go? Like, wreck it and fix it. Yeah, obviously. To you for this. That should be the answer. Oh, it was the answer. Fucking heard her. Complete the phrase as cool as a cucumber. <sighs> so you're quite... Let's go with A. Let's go with A. You took it. Which liquid is most likely to cause a slick? What? I know what a slick is. What is a slick? Cause a slick? Okay, we can we can we can use our one on four IQ here to deduct the answer. So orange juice. Okay, what most likely cause a slick? Okay, what do these have in common? Orange juice. Okay, oil, vinegar. Okay, vinegar and wine is very similar. Uh, oil is the only one that stands out out of all of these. I'm gonna go with oil. I don't know what a slick is, but I am going with one for IQ. You figured it out perfectly. Oil is a bait. <laughs> Your asshole is a bait. What is a slick? What is a slick? Time to move on to a new question. An oil slip? Slippery? What the, I don't know. It's a stupid word. What did the White House release in April 2011 to end a controversy over President Obama? His birth certificate. My gut says that it's C. Okay, C. C. So, you really know your answer. Our team of editors... The Super Bowl is always question. played on which day? I think it's a Thursday. Uh, I guess something is telling me Thursday right away, but I'm probably wrong because sports. I'm gonna switch to question. I'm sorry. Let's I the question right now. Hoping that the new one will bring I cannot you do American sports, man. It's impossible. Sunday. Okay. Sunday is bait. No. I think we all agree that we can move on to this Pete Wentz question. is best known for playing bass in what band? chooses D. I don't know. You had to make a choice. Is that your final answer? That will be my final answer. You took your time, but you are right. Okay. I took the time to think, and it paid off. It's time to move on to a new question. Alright, which planet is the headquarters of Green Lantern Corps? Mm-hmm. Uh, I think it's O-O-A. Uh, I'm just gonna go with O-A. 
Yeah. And let's go for A. And now to the most important question of all. Is this your final answer? That's my final answer. The choice is made. It's time to discover the right uh. answer. Well done. Now the good news is that you can't lose anything. New question coming up. Is it? Good luck to you. Which river flows through Warsaw? Ah, I wish to care about world events. Now what? Or world geographics. All right. The Volga. Okay, so the only one that sticks out for me is the Elbe. It's the only thing that sticks out at all, out of all these names. That doesn't mean that it's in Warsaw, it could be somewhere else. Um, yeah, Volga is the one that sounds the most Polish out of all of these, but it's American name for it, so that doesn't make any difference. Uh, we're gonna have to... Uh, my asshole. Audience. You decided to appeal to the audience. I don't we'll know. Vote now to help you. I don't know. Uh, D. The Vistula. Okay. Choosing D. It inspires confidence in me. Audience is mating. Final answer. Yeah, you are the You're audience. Sure? Oh, yes. That's my final answer. You have made your choice. You got it. Yeah, right. buddy. Well done. I believed it to the end. To the very end. This new question is now waiting for you to be answered with flying colors. Which popular cocktail contains a mixture of advoca advocat? Advocat? An avocado? No, but that one's the right answer. Advocate is an alcohol. Less. And lemonade. Well, I know it's not screwdriver, because that's orange juice and vodka. Uh, sidecar, I don't know. Snowball. That is something completely different. <laughs> uh, Singapore sling. Singapore sling. Lemonade. Hmm. Uh, I mean, it's B or D, I think. Uh, I have 50 50 remaining, so I'm gonna okay, use it on this let's one. Let's take away two incorrect I, answers. Please knock it down to that. I, I have to. Okay, so it's a uh, snowball. Let's go for C. So this is your final answer? That will be my final answer. Okay, the computer validated your answer. That's the one. That was the right answer. I can't believe it. I wish I knew what the word advocate is. The game is I'm off to a that. good start, but you shouldn't stop there. Here is a new question. Mm, Dutch alcoholic beverage made from eggs, sugar, brandy. Okay. Uh, in which country was the former ABBA member Frida Lingstad born? I mean, you don't even have to. Hey. Oh, whoa, whoa, yes, whoa, 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 whoa. Is this a bait somehow? She was born somewhere else, maybe? Nah. Are you absolutely sure? Is that your final <laughs> answer? Yes, that's my final answer. 
If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. Is it bait? Was she born like Norway? Oh my god, it was bait! No, it was actually bait! That's the wrong answer. Good. Oh my god. So Oh my god. Congratulations. You are leaving here with your safety net, and I'm glad it paid off. Oh my god. Oh my god. When I saw the word Ling in front of Stod, I was like, that doesn't sound very Swedish. But I think Norwegians spell Stod, which means uh, town with a T. But do they not? Or is that Denmark? Yeah, they spell it with a T. So they they or that you can spell it with a T in Norwegian. I don't, I don't know. I googled it now. A Norwegian S T A D T means city in English, but maybe I don't know. We can do both. It's dialect. Yeah, okay. Alright, well... My ass... I was a bait! Alright, no more baits, and we're, we'll have a million. Or bait, but make it obvious bait. Either way is fine. Hey, Rezgar lead, welcome. Uh, yo damn, rain dude, don't commit suicide. Ostrogothic, Justin Magnum and Elf Bosk, thanks for seven. Three, seven. Obvious answer equals bait. No. Yeah. Sometimes that's the biggest bait. They don't do it consistently. No, but that All right. Is the right answer. What is the name of the coffee specially treated to minimize preparation time? It's called instant coffee. I'm gonna say bait. bait. Final? Just own it. Trust you. <laughs> In which championship does Bayern Munich play? Uh. Well, I guess the German championship. And Massimo chooses D. Yes, you are right. I think we all agree that we can. Which of these would be question. specifically looked after in kennels while the family goes on vacation? What? Which of these would be specifically looked after in? Kennels. Which of these would be specifically looked after in kennels? What? I don't understand the question. Like the dogs would be looked after. Uh, I don't understand the funny question. Uh, I'm gonna this question. By using the flip, you That's a bait question, right? Noise. Oh, it's a cat. Well, all of these are. Uh, Here's what? a new question for you. I don't, I don't understand the question. During which World Cup year was the video assistant referee system introduced? Video assistant referee system introduced. Are you f This is a $200 question. You have to know about. We don't know what fucking World Cup in what? Football? Soccer? My god. Jesus Christ, man. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, you heard it. We need a little help here. If you would pick up those keypads and enter your votes now. Okay. And let's go for A. It's a bait question, you know why? Everyone who answered correctly in chat, permabend them chat mods. Yes, that's my final Perma. answer. If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. That's an answer I can get behind. I believed it to the end. 
I did a good job. So let's move on to a whole new question. I got some sugar-free brownie, boys. Mmm. Which German musician composed the theme für Lies? Easy. And I would say B, obviously. Are you sure? That's my final answer. The choice is made. Well done. Let's go for this new. Which supervillain was friends with Wonder Woman in the past? I don't know any of these except for. Is this a. Yeah. Let's go with A. Cheetah. You've reached that threshold, the money is safe. Good luck to you for this new question. Mm. Who brought home the gold medal for the long jump in 1930 <laughs> Berlin? Oh my god. I recognize this guy's name. 50-50. You like that? Nah. I mean, if this name pops up, I would pick it, but what if it doesn't pop up? Then I turn a 50-50 into another 50-50, which makes for a very poor situation. Okay, right. please take away two random wrong answers and leave the correct answer and the one remaining wrong answer. that it's C. Final answer? You sure? That will be my final answer. Ah! Oh, I'm so sorry. There's really a bit. One at all. It's disappointing. <laughs> they left it on purpose. They have voice recognition. Respect for playing the game. On the fucking... They don't tell you about it. Alright. Now I'm gonna be actually serious, alright? I'm just gonna eat this brownie and then we'll have the energy, the sugar-free energy. This guy sucks. Julie, 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 Julie! Please don't take my lifelines away from me. for this new question. Man. Are you kidding me? I knew it was Iris. <laughs> well then the... <laughs> Bro. How the fuck do you... Barry Allen's girlfriend who the fuck cares uh, dude uh. I'm trying to go with West it's so A I or D I think. think is that your final answer I don't know that's my final answer. Did how do you... The choice is made. You oh my god. 
We believe it. It's climbing quickly. Let's keep our strength. Uh, that was a hundred dollar question, bro. I had to shit my pants for a hundred dollar question. And your acquaintances for this new question. Well, it's normally seen about a pair of crossbones on the Jolly Rogers flag, a skull. I know the answer, and it's A. Just own it. You got it. You got it. Okay, next one. Okay, next one. It's time to move on to a new question. What were the names of the Catholic kings of Spain? Catholic kin kings? What? Half of these are female names. I feel like I should know this. Fernando and Isabel. Felipe and Isabel. Fernando, Cristina, Felipe, Cristina. I'm almost certain that the male uh, is called Felipe. Almost certain. Like 80% certain. Uh, that will live a 50-50. Isabel or Cristina? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Give me a 50 50 then, and, and hope it's not B and D remaining. The correct answer and the Fuck one it. remaining wrong answer. Alright. Okay, D. Don't um, cry for me, uh, Christina. Is that your final answer? It's a bit. Mm, what? That's my it's final a. answer. You have given your final answer. You can't always win. That's the wrong answer. Sorry. No. Bro, what? What are kings? Why is there a female name? Who is the king? Who? There's a queen. It's not kings plural. It's a one king name. One guy. Isabel cannot be a king. And what are these questions? 100. These are ridiculous early questions, huh? It's bugged. They put the one million dollar questions in the start. So let's move on to a whole new question. Gaspacho. I'm pretty sure it's tomato. But there's also a cucumber the right soup. Answer. I can feel it. I just have to think which one is which. It's the okay. wrong answer. Nice! Well, nice! What is the... Okay. Perspective. I um, no, no, that was just him. Well, which one is the tomato it's soup? The it's answer. gazpacho one and then there is a stro... stro... minestro... minestro... What is it called? The tomato one. Minestrone. Yeah. Yeah, she sucks. She obviously is getting, like, I don't know why she's getting the hardest. It's not even a hard question, but I was just tempted. Uh, Alright. This time we're gonna make it. Alright. We just need more Harry Potter. Alright. We'll go with George. Alright, here we go. We need Harry Potter. And then uh, we need some uh, DC, right? And uh, we're fucking good. Right? Alright. Who directed the movie Psycho 1960? Uh 1960. I'm going to pick A. And what will be your final answer? That's what we were I think we all agree that we can move. Who plays Luke Skywalker in the Star Wars movie? Mark Ham. I'm choosing B. You had well, All right, well, here we go, come on, good luck to you. Which of these is an expression of frustration and irritation? For John's sake, for Pete's sake. C. That's the right choice. Final or as answer? Cat Piss Everdeen oh. would say, yes. PETA! That's my final answer. The choice is made. That's an answer. 
Your new question is ready. Good Which luck. of these is a winter sport contested by Tobogans down a purpose built ice track? Tobogans. What? But why did I have to be the one to get this Good question? Word. Um, my instincts are telling me A. But my body, my body is the Levine lifeline. I'm gonna switch the question. So let's change the question. I think A is bait. Well used. Are you ready for this new question? Which of these is often brought to the dinner table in a boat? Bread boat, that sounds familiar. Uh, gravy. I thought it was a gravy train. Wait, hang on a second. Is it a gravy train? Is it actually bread boat? Wait, I know bread boat is a Minecraft meme. Don't remember where it's from. Some Minecrafter. Which of these is often brought to the dinner table in a boat? In a boat. Oops. Uh, gravy. Is it, is it called Gravy Train? But are you referring to the little uh, genie lamp looking pouring gravy thingy? I'm just gonna go gravy. I, I'm, I'm just gonna go gravy. I'm, I'm probably is overthinking it otherwise. Yes, that's my final answer. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. Oh my god, why are they calling it the gravy boat when it's called the gravy train? Is it not called a gravy train? New question coming up. Good luck to you. Which of Wonder Woman's enemies can become immense? Bro, why is it nothing but Wonder Woman? Huh? I don't know what Wonder Woman. Which of Wonder Woman's enemies can become immense? What does immense mean? Immense. I thought immensely was like big. I guess immense means big then. Immense means probably big. And this is colossal, giganta, titania. Probably one of these. Probably. But she's also like, yeah, I mean, she's a Greek, right? Amazon, no, she's Amazon. Uh, Giganta. I want to say Giganta. Uh, but Titania could be like, Metal or it could be like tight and big, you know What the fuck is this shit? Okay. I'm gonna have a 50 50 and hope it's not B and C answers. remaining It's B and C remaining I'm choosing C final Um, That's my final answer You reach that It was wasted I should have just guessed it, but I wasn't sure. Question? Which enemy of Aqua... Dude, Aquaman and... Where's my Batman? Huh? Where's my Superman? Where's my fucking... Uh... Um... Aqua Salad. Ocean Man. Well... Uh, Black Manta is the only villain of Aquaman that I recognize, actually, so this is a 
Thousand dollar question. I'm gonna go with Black Manta. He seems pretty good. No lifeline. I'm gonna say D. I know you are waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. Is this your final answer? It's the guy with the yes, white helmet, that's right? My final answer. Like black helmet looking motherfucker. I think. The choice yeah. is made. Well done. You got it. One right answer found easily. Stewie Griffin looking motherfucker. I think. All right. Are you ready to face the traps of this next question? Good luck. The traps? Ah, it calls out the bait. In the film Back to the Future, Michael J. Fox travels in time to which year? Uh, he travels to... But why did I have to be the one to get this He question? travels to 1955. He travels to 1955. But let's see, does he said traps? I don't like traps. 1955. Because uh, he's already in the 80s, right? That's like a 20 year old. So if he goes back and his mother got him probably when he was like 40 or when she was like between, uh, maybe like 30. So he goes back. 20, yeah, it has to be 55, right? Uh, yeah. No more hesitating. I'm gonna say D. And what will be your it has to be. Answer. None of the other makes sense because That's he goes answer. to the high school of his mother. Oh, right. I can't wait to see the correct answer. You figured it. Yes. The game is off to a good start, but you shouldn't stop there. Here is a new question. Which of these is a term for a male otter? A male otter. Okay, so a stag is like a deer elk looking motherfucker, right? A bull is for a cow. A pig is... A pig is... Dog. Male otter. A pig. Would that be a pig? A male otter. Would that be a pig or a dog? It's pig or dog for sure, but what? I never heard any of these, so I'm gonna be honest. Uh, I feel stupid not to do the 50 50 if it, because it's not any of these. Most likely, it would most likely be this, I think. Or this. I have to do it. Okay, I have to ask the audience. Women, you heard it. We need a little help. Pick up those keys. It's all baits. All everything is bait. Answer is E. Audience is not very sure either. I'm certain that it's B. You had to make a choice. Is that your final answer? Oh, yes, that's my final answer. Male otter. Well, educational stream. At you least. have made your choice. That is correct. And there we have it. Oh, you can. Oh, you can see which. The game life is getting likes. tougher now yeah. with this brand new question. Who was one of the creators of scientific socialism? Uh, scientific? Is this a bait or what? See. I mean, That's I don't. Right I recognize Rousseau, but I don't know where from where. I don't know what he invented. I'm just gonna go with bait. You sure? Bait. Yes. <laughs> I'm gonna That's go my bait. Final answer. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right. Am one. I baited? Woo! So I can get behind. Scientific socialism. Oh, that's perfect. Sure, Lee. Hey, don't spell my username. Thank you for sub. Boohies, Sento, Greg, Wonder Toad, Animan, Never Knows Best, and Fun Zills. Thanks for subbing.
with seven, which American sprinter was the 100 meter gold medalist in 1992, 1996? Uh, Inge Miller doesn't sound, Inge is not a very uh, American name. Uh, Marion. Is that a woman's name? Maybe they're referring to the women's hundred meters. Um, I don't know. I'm gonna have to use this. It's certainly better to be alone than in bad company. But it's a uh, sportsman, 100 meter no gold medalist. Right I wish they would have had the Hussein Bolt somewhere. It's the only one I know. Why would my wife know? Colleague. Childhood friend he knows for sure. Ignore me. Hello? Yes, Peter. It's George. As expected, I need your help for a question. <laughs> awesome. I'm on television. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna do my best. You can count on me. Hey, you should try C. I think it's the right one. Shit. I'm choosing C. You know what the <laughs> next question is, right? Is this your final answer? That'll be my final answer. Here you try Z. The choice is made. It's time to discover the right answer. <laughs> Oh my god, I got paid it! It's the end for you. Oh no my god. It's a game after all. Oh, that's a disaster. You were piling along, but you've lost everything down to your safety net. Ah, fuck off, man. A uh, childhood friend, man. He doesn't give a shit. He wants you to fail, obviously. I was too cool for the reunion. Okay, never call Peter again. Should have asked the wife. Yeah, the wife would probably have given me better odds. Than you. Shit. Which shitty hosted the Summer Olympics game in 2012? That's London. Brussels. See, that's the right choice. Yes. Good luck to you. Uh, 2012 was uh, 12 years ago, chat. Complete the title of the TV legal drama series starring John Thaw, Kevin o. What? Complete the title of the TV legal drama series starring John Thaw. What? I don't know. Uh, I had to, if I had to guess, quo. I actually don't know. What is question two? I have never heard of this shit. You use the flip. It's a tough choice. Good luck. QC. Trust yourself and your acquaintances for this new question. Which what cheese is used to make tiramisu? I'll tell you what cheese is made or is used. It's Cottage cheese. I'm choosing C. You can't what? always win. That's the wrong answer. Okay. Sugar free guess, I guess. But uh which one has cottage cheese then? Wait, which one has cottage cheese? There is a there is a pastry with uh, cheesecake. 
Cheesecake. Isn't cheese... Yeah, cheesecake with cottage cheese. No, sorry. It's Ustkaka. Ustkaka. I don't know if this is a thing for you guys. Wait, isn't this cheesecake? This is in Swedish. Okay, this one. Look at this. Isn't this cheesecake? This was like back in the day when I was a kid. You got served this. Is this not cheesecake? No, it's not. I thought it was like some variant. Some Swedish, like uh, Swedish pancakes are not the same as American pancakes. I don't know what, what this is in, in English though, but yeah, this is what I was thinking about with cottage cheese. Okay, that was unlucky. That, well, I got baited by being Swedish. Yeah, very, very baited. Okay, no more baits now. We're gonna, we're gonna make a million. Press one if you believe. Press two if you do not believe I will fail. That was a bait. What goes around comes around, chat. Welcome back to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Which of these is a successful uh, British band? It's safe. I'm sure. Radiohead. I'm sure of it. In the song, Hercules goes from zero to hero. Okay, zero to hero. I made my choice, and I'm zero to hero. D. You had to make a choice. Is that your final answer? <laughs> uh, yeah. The lines are coming in. We need more lines. Questions. Yeah. It's time to move. What name is given to a track used by athletes in the long jump and triple jump? Ah, uh, shit. Okay. So this is when, this is the ski slope. This is when you go behind a car, right? Uh, runway or path. I'm guessing runway is for, for airplanes. And then path would be the only remaining option. So I guess and I go I path. Say C. I have no doubt. Hey! The bait! This is the wrong answer. The bait! They had it for airplanes? I mean, it makes sense that it would be called runway, but airplanes are called runway. Maybe airplanes stole it from the sport. Okay, it was bait. It was bait. I should have considered the... Uh, uh, yeah, it, it was bait. I should have considered the time remaining. Alright. Uh, it's fine. Alright. We just take it cool now. We have to always take into consideration the question. Okay? The level. I mean. What sort of vehicle is used to clear land of building or trees? Well, that's a bulldozer. This is a level 1 question. There are no baits on the level 1 question. Now the baits start. Which country has won the most medals in alpine skiing? Well, it makes sense that Austria has won the most, considering uh, they barely have any snowy peaks in these countries. I'm so, going to choose B. Final answer? You sure? B is not a bait. You there is no way. New question there is no way. Good the flowers of the herb chamomile are often used to make which sort of beverage? Tea. We'll see, we'll see. The winner gets... <laughs> and I'm going to say A. Are you sure? Hmm... That's my final answer. Final. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. This new question it was the correct answer. Hard time what makes up each book of the Old and New Testaments in the Bible? Chapters and verses. Let's go for C. Yeah, let's go. I was just checking if it was a bait Final somehow. Just a but no. Here's a new question for you. What is the most populous metropolitan area in the world? Uh, 
Mm hmm. I actually don't know this. Interesting. I mean, China has the highest population, right? Followed by India. Uh, but that doesn't mean that it has the most populous metropolitan in the world. That could be Tokyo. It can't be Moscow. Hmm. I think I should say Beijing here. When they say populous metropolitan, are they referring to amount of people living in the city in total? Or are they referring to how many people per square meter? That is what I'm thinking. Because if it's per square meter, it could be a different answer. Like per square meter of the city. I'm gonna go with... This is a level 4 question. I'm gonna go with Beijing. Now it's definitely I don't want to waste my lifelines. Final answer? You sure? Oh, yes. That's my final answer. You have given your final answer. Now is the time to see the right one. It could be Tokyo. Uh, what a okay. idiot. Unlucky. This Fucking is... shit, man. The answer is the same regardless, he says. Like a... Huh? Don't at me with your shit brain. Or maybe you're right. I don't know. But you're not right. It was Tokyo. Okay. In the English language, which letter nearly always follows the letter Q in a word? Uh... You? Yeah, D's good for me. That's the right one. You had well done. You. I think we all agree that we can move. What does Bat? What city does Batman protect? All right, we need more motherfucking. Oh, Arkham City almost got beta there. Well, let's go for D. We need more Batman, and then we win. Batman, Harry Potter into Batman, Harry Potter into DC yep. into Batman. That's my final answer. Of course. Here's a new question. Oh, Which word refers specifically to the removal of wool from a sheep? Shearing. B, no doubt. It, let's go, let's go, man. More. Give me some Harry Potter in this motherfucker. In military history, what was a red coat? A red coat was a. Mm, hmm. Red coat. Sounds a little bit familiar. I want to say navy. But mm, the British had red coats. No, it's definitely A. I'm gonna go with A. Are you absolutely sure? Is that your final amp? You pulled it off. Easy for the god gamer. Okay, well done. Yet another right answer for me. Here's a new question for I didn't look at chat. You fucking suck dick. In an infamous 1997 WBA boxing match, Mike Tyson took a bite out of which part? His ear. Took a bite of a crime. A? Yeah, let's go for A. Final answer? You sh now you are up to the threshold. Well done. Who starred in the films on the waterfront and streetcar named Desire? Uh, uh, I don't remember, but I've, I've probably seen this one. Uh, my, I would just say A, but since I don't remember, it could be D. Uh, Danny DeVito is 
different kind of character and I don't think it's a Robert De Niro movie. I'm gonna swap with the questions, even though I think it's A. Question Could be doesn't B. inspire B. you, and that is why you choose to use your flip lifeline. Well yeah. done. Yeah. That inspire me. Yeah. Let's go for this new eliminatory question. Don't look. Which 1997 film starring Pierce Brosnan was based uh, on a short story by Stephen King? I will tell you. Shovel Man. Grass Man. I haven't seen Pierce Brosnan in anything else but Bond movies from 1990. Uh, and the latest Cape shit uh, where he plays the magician guy. Black Adam. Shit movie. Um, Sprinkler Man, The Shovel Man. All right, Stephen King. We have read some Stephen King, yeah. But I cannot remember any of these being. Uh, man, I don't. I don't know. I am going to uh, ask the audience. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, Shit. you heard it. We need a little help here. If you would pick up those keypads and enter your votes now. Oof, that's very split. Lawnmower Man, that sounds like a stupid name for a movie, not gonna lie. Yeah, that's my final answer. You have given your final answer. But I guess. Now is the time to see the right one. You took your time, but you are right. All right. Yeah, <laughs> I'm amazing. Yeah, take the credit. See what happens. Are you ready to face the traps of this next question? Good luck to you. Which of these words refer to workers or working class people? Plebs. Wage cucks. I know the answer, of course. Oh, let's think. Prolactin. Is it lac lactate? What pregnant women do? Or proliferate and proletariat. Okay, so. Pro life rate. Proletariat. I would say C. I'm just gonna say C because we have wasted too many lines. Okay. Yeah. Let's go for C. Yeah, let's see. go. Is that your final? Oh, yes. That's my final answer. You have made your choice. Just own it. You got it. Nice. Oh, I just had to answer that question. And here's a new question that I hope won't worry you. Past sixth grade, bitch, please. Not everyone had English words. All right. In their education, growing up. Idiota. It's not English. That's why I guessed it. Because it wasn't English. Right? <laughs> Idiot. Which of these groups campaign for vote votes for women? Abol abolish abolitionists. <laughs> Abolitionists, uh, abolitionists, uh, what the fuck? Lidits, mugwumps, sugar free, shifra gets. Um, which of these groups campaigned for votes for women? Okay. 
Uh, abolin, abol, abolitionists, abolish, to abolish something is to remove something. Uh, suffragettes, Lurits. Mugwumps. That sounds like out of Harry Potter, man. Lurits. Sounds like what they're taking in Wolf of Wall Street. Suffragettes. Sounds... I think it's A, honestly. Uh, but, I mean... Okay, let's They're gonna remove mugwumps and suffragettes and then I'm gonna sit there like an idiot. I'm just gonna do it. It's beat. Yeah, no. Final. That will be my final answer. What? If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. Oh now you suddenly know about this is the women's not the right rights, answer. huh? Huh? Be consistent, cocksuckers. Okay, the suffragettes, that's not even, like, Americans can't, see, can't even pronounce that shit. Universal suffrage? But it's not universal, though. It's like half. Right. It doesn't make sense. It was I was a bait. Uh, Safra, they can't even spell suffer. Hmm? What the fuck is a Ludite? Finish the title of this carol. God rest ye. Oh man, I don't know Christmas carols. I'm the fucking Grinch. God rest ye merry gentlemen, tipsy gentlemen, kind gentlemen. Happy gentlemen. Merry I'm going yes. to choose B. Well done. You're not sure. To which group of superheroes does Kid Flash belong? It's easier when you're behind the screen. Kid Flash? Well, the Flash is DC and the Teen Titans is Little DC League, right? Some shit. Yeah. D's good for me. That's the right one. And what? You got it right. Here's a new question for you. Which of these movies is the oldest per its release date in theaters? Okay. Oh, come on. I know the answer, of course. Uh. Stick. Empire Strikes I'm Back. I'm going to say A. You seem to be convinced. You figured it out perfectly. Nice answer. I was just thinking when the last Jedi was. Uh, okay, well. Trust yourself and your acquaintances. Uh, in the sporting context, which color is associated with Oxford University? I haven't met this Quidditch team yet. Oh. <sighs> um. I think it's dark blue or light blue. It's definitely some blue. That I know. I think it's dark blue, but I'm just okay, gonna do 50 take away 50 here. Two random wrong answers. Remove the pink and red, lil. Alright, dark blue. Okay, well, the right answer is. C. You took your time. Yeah, it had to be done. It had to be done. Question. Which skater was allowed to compete in 1994 Winter Olympics despite being implicated in an attack on one of her rivals? Did I watch a movie with this? I'm going to replace the questions because I don't remember even if I watched the Using movie. Using the flip, you decided to be wise. Okay. 
New question coming up. Was it with Margaret right Robbie? Oh, that's why I watched it. I was like, why would I watch a movie with uh, skiing? That explains it. Uh, sorry, it's ice, ice skating, not skiing. Uh, which country is the largest producer of cocoa? <clears throat> I would say Ecuador. Okay. Ecuador! Let's go. But oh, I'm so sorry. Ivory Coast. Oh, okay. It just is that even a country? Warning. Oh no. Unfortunately, it's all over. How sad. I got baited. I got bait, baited by uh, drug cartels in South America. Alright, uh, that doesn't count. They can't bait that early or it doesn't count. Switch to NA. It's, it's still NA. It doesn't matter what region. It's still throwing everything. Alright, this time we're getting the million. Alright. Which of these buildings is intended to store a collection of books? A library. All right. That's the right one. That's the one. Not bad, not bad for a start. Blade has the same powers as which creature of the night? A vampire. What do you mean he has the same powers? Say, hey. He is a fucking vampire. Seem to be convinced, but is this your? What the fuck? That is correct. Yeah. <laughs> I'm amazing. He's only half. I think we all agree that we yeah, can move on to this still question. a vampire. He's a daywalker. What is the square root of 625? I'll tell you what the square root of 625 is. It's 25. Okay. Well, the right answer is C. Is that your final? Hmm. That's my final answer. You have given your final answer. Now is the time to see the right one. That is the right answer. And one more point for yours truly. This new question shouldn't give you a hard time, in theory. Which of these is the act of ceremony of crowning a monarch? Uh, well, coronation. Oh. Um, is uh, this is stars? This is correlation. The word carnation is massacre ish, whatever correlation okay. is the word. Let's go for C. Yeah, let's go. Alright, so just this double checking everything. Final answer. Final answer. <laughs> That's my Corona Nation. <laughs> you took your time, but you are right. Oh, I just had to answer that question. I th what kind of creature is the glove puppet Orville? Glove puppet Orville. I have never heard of an Orville. Glove puppet Orville. We're gonna have to replace the question here. So let's change the question. A flip life. I would have said used. monkey. It was not. Good luck to you for this new question. In Anna Seals' classic children's novel, what is Black Beauty? A horse. Ah. No, it's definitely A. Correct answer. You've reached the threshold. Yes. You hear that, chat? Uh, Rune Bullebale, Philip HMM, Carithian, Turk and the Fourth, and Warring Iron. You. Thank you, boys. Welcome back. Welcome. Who played Jack Boyer on the, the series 24? Classic, but I don't remember his name at all. I think this is the only one that sticks out. I should probably do a 50-50 though. Or you're going for the million and you save it. 
and go with this one. No, do the 50-50. Okay, we will take Where two incorrect it? answers away. This was my second actually, so that's not I'm going to choose but, yeah. B. Is that your final answer? Mm, that's my final answer. The choice is made. Uh, Absolutely. Shit. Why even use it? Because I wasn't over 80 I wasn't over 90% sure, and that's the rule. Which track and field event started life as the hop, step and jump? What? Hop, step, triple jump. Yeah, I'm confident. I'm saying C. So this is your final C is answer. not a bait. That will be my final answer. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. It's not a bait! It's, it's not a bait. We watch a lot of triple right jump on that women's sports channel during intro. You will be asked a new question now. Now! Declan McAnus is, uh, is the original name of which pop singer? Uh Hmm Okay Uh So this is the guy is this the guy who does sex bomb I think it's Tom Jones. I don't remember. Uh, I don't see why he would switch it to Tom Jones. If I had to pick, I would probably say David Bowie. Because he's a bit weird. Uh, he would change his name in a heartbeat. I don't know actually who had this name. Unfortunately. Waste a lifeline or say D. Waste a lifeline or say D. I'm gonna go with David Bowie, Elvis, uh, Sting. Mm, take it away. We'll do it live. Okay, audience, we need some help here. Okay, audience. Wow, is it actually Elvis? Okay. Okay, well, the right answer is C. Is that your final? <laughs> That's my final answer. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. I hope so too. Well done. You got it. And one oh, more wrong Elvis. Yours truly. Which of these is a former province of Japan? Uh, Clementine, Kumquat, Tangerine, Satsuma. These are all citrus fruits, right? Kumquat too. Uh, this is the only one that sounds Japanese. So I'm just gonna okay. Let's assume. Let's go for C. And yeah, not waste let's anything. go. Final answer. Mm, what is a kumquat? That's my final answer. If this is your final answer, let's hope it's the correct answer. Oh my God! It's oh, about I the kumquat, the uh, little orange. Will you be able to answer this new question as well? I don't know. At the end of Midnight Run, what does Jonathan give Jack to thank him? What? Her car? 
At the end of Midnight Run, what does Jonathan give Jack to thank him? Her car. I mean, I guess it's the current year, but that is very bait confusing. Uh. I mean, only this makes sense. Like, why would you give someone a belt? Like, that's just weird. Uh, jacket makes sense, kinda, depending on. I don't know. It's just. I mean, A is probably bait, right? So it has to be D. A has to be bait. So it has to be D. Like, A is just, like, too... Whatever. A has to be bait. I'm sorry. A belt and car doesn't... Her car. Who, her? Uh, I'm going with... I'm going with D. I'm going with B. Not D. You had to make a choice. Is that your final answer? I... I mean... Like, who gives a belt? Well, what? Well, why would you give a belt? The choice is made. It's time to discover the right answer. A jacket to Jack. It gave a belt. Huh? What is the movie about? Sorry. Losing weight? No way. What the no, fuck? At this level of the game? Oh, that's a disaster. You were piling along, but you've lost everything down to your safety net. It's gut wrenching, isn't it? It has money in it. It's a WWE belt. Oh my god. Who? I could have used the lifeline, but I mean, come on. Obviously, you don't give a belt to someone. That's so weird. So here, I have my used belt. Alright, this time we're gonna get it. We just need more DC, man. More Harry Potter. Alright, we need to get lucky here a little bit. Not, no, fuck the sports question. Alright. Fuck the geography questions. In Back to the Future, what does Dolorain use to travel back in time? What? Uh, is this supposed to be car brands or some shit? This is a character name. Andrew Clark is not a car name. Ferris Bueller? I guess it's a Gaston yeah. Lagaffe. D's good for me. That's the right one. Oh, what? No. You were so close. Oh wow! That Bro, I don't. Wait, that's a car too. Hey, I don't know a fucking car. I don't have a license. All right. I'm still waiting for Elon Musk for self-driving cars. He said. We're waiting ten years. All right. Uh, uh, that's not supposed. To... Uh, no, no. no, that doesn't count, man. You all know that doesn't count. That's just like. Stupid ass. According to the saying, what should you do if you can't stand the heat? Uh, get out of the kitchen, okay. I guess. Let's go. Uh, I haven't never yeah, heard of this Is saying, but uh, it's the only one that doesn't yourself? suck dick. Uh -huh. huh. Which of the following is a form of a poker? Stud. A? Yeah, let's go for a. What? That. In Escape from New York 1997, Escape from New York, what does Snake Plissken have to save? Oh shit! The daughter of the president. I'm going to choose B. So this is your oh, final We saw this. Thank you, intro voice. Yep. That's my final up. What? What a pity. But he has the woman that he gives the thingy. Oh wow, that was really bad. Why would uh, the president try and kill him? If he Never saved the president, explain end. that. Sad. What? <coughs> That's the sequel. <coughs> I'm allergic to baits. Alright. No, no further baits. Which of these is a small animal related to squirrel? 
A chipmunk. Now, it's definitely a kill. <coughs> what the, the fuck? Of course. It's time to. If you floss, you clean between uh, teeth. A? Yeah. Let's legs. Go Where's my zoomer legs? Final? Yep. Zienna Vienna, I think for one year. And during the badge. You have me. Yes. You are right. <coughs> what the fuck? Good luck. What is the name of Django's Fett's clone son? Boba! Boba. Booba. Booba. Wait. Boba. Okay. Let's go for C. Yeah, let's go. You really know your answer? I really know my answers. Give you a hard time in theory. Charleston is the chief commercial center at and seaport of South what? South Park, South Africa, not South Korea. Not South Park. Carolina, has to be Carolina. It could be South, this could be Africa. South Africa or South Carolina? I'm gonna go with Carolina. Yeah, D's good for me. That's the right one. Of course. Oof. All right. Okay, okay, well done. Yet another right answer for me. Trust yourself and your acquaintances for this new question. What is aspic in cooking? I don't know. If I had to guess, I would say I would say B, but I don't know. It's time to use the flip and change the current question. Cold dish and gelatin. Good luck to you for this new question. Which word goes with kith to make a phrase relating to family and friends? What? What? Which word goes with kith? 
I mean, this is the only word that relates to family and friend, but what I don't understand the question. Kith and kin? And I'm going to say A. Kith. Final answer. I guess Kith means friends sure? then. Right. <laughs> That's my final answer. The choice is correct answer. You Come on. And cooking answer, to what does an espu oh, espuma speaking. refer? Espuma. In Spanish for It's Spanish cream is nata, foam is espuma. No, it's definitely A. You really know your answer. Yeah! <laughs> I'm amazing! Concentrate, here's a new question for you. Real Spaniard. In Brother Bear, what is the name of the human who is turned into a bear? Uh, I think I've seen this one. Uh, but I don't remember. Coda sounds sure. familiar. Oh, God, it's hard. I'm 80% sure. Well, I'm taking it. D I'm taking it. We, we just gotta go for it. Final? Yep. I'm ninety percent sure. You have made. I'm eighty percent sure. Twenty percent bait. I'm not using my lifeline. Fucking shit! If only I was ninety percent. Who remembers this? Huh? Is it possible? Alright, we're getting the million now. In the name of a cable cha channel, what did MTV originally stand for? Uh, music? Television? Alright, which of these is a spicy dish of Lu Louisiana? Bro, what? Rambo, sounds pretty spicy. Dumbo is an elephant. Question. You choose to play wisely when using your flip the question. Good luck to you. Gumbo? What the fuck is a gumbo? New Spicy dish. Up. Good luck to you. Spicy for ants, maybe. In America. Which of these actors starred in multiple films as Boxer Rocky Balboa? Sylvester No, it's definitely A. A. You took your time. Where on a horse's body is a horseshoe fixed? A? Yeah, let's go for A. Final? You pulled it off. What else? This new question shouldn't give you a hard time. In what theory. novel inspired the 1999 film Cruel Intentions? Uh Seriously? How could I draw a blank on this question? Uh... It's now up to the audience to I choose what they Fuck. think is the right answer. Good luck. Not good. Dangerous liaison. Okay. Well, let's go for D. D. Final answer? D. You sure? That's an answer I can get behind. And one more point for yours truly. Gumbo is Creole food and would probably New make Swedes shit up. their intestines Good luck to you. I mean, I guess we don't eat very much spicy food over here. I was just saying... I was just saying, man. Uh, spicy food ain't good for you, man. Oh. There's a name of the television series that came out in today based on the Terminator franchise. 
Uh, Sarah Connor Chronicles. Um, I'd say D. You got to the You got it! Baby, she's got it! Trust yourself and your acquaintances. Trust yourself and your acquaintances for the new question. Who is my acquaintances? In the 1970s Superman movie, what title does Louis Lane give to her interview with Superman? Oh, seriously? How could I draw a blank on this question? B. No doubt. Ah! Oh, pity. This is the wrong answer. Fake fan! Okay, it just ends like that without. It just ends like that. I, I got nothing. I got forty quids. Oh, I can't believe you've done this. I can't believe you've done this. Hey, there was not an online. I right. online multiplayer. International. They're all. The game will start in 22 seconds. Ha! <laughs> 50 players? And they're not googling? Are you kidding me? Welcome. Let's play Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? This new question shouldn't give you a hard time, in theory. What are placed at the ends of railway tracks stop trains coming off the line? Oh man. I think it was honestly stoppers. Buffers. I honestly think it was stoppers. Buffers. Sorry, it's over for you this time, but it was honestly an interesting game. Uh, yeah, and then you had to like leave you on the screen for two hours. Come on. Alright, that doesn't that doesn't fucking count. Alright. Online was there. Alright. I mean how how do you prevent people from googling this shit? Like how do you make this fair? People are just why people are such cheaters, huh? People are such cheaters, they get this game just to Google the answers. Fifteen second timer. Oh, you can't Google in ten seconds and then swap and enter the answer. On who wants to be a millionaire? I think we all agree that we can move on to this new question. Yes, I agree. Which of these means to be level in a race? Neck and neck.
Many participants are still in the running for the win. Minus two. Try to hold on to your position for as long as possible. Here's a new question for you. What passed near Earth in 1986? All right. Minus zero. Go Google. Go Google. I have 31 Googlers in this room. Oh my God. Good luck. Which of these is an abbreviation of the name of a famous ancient Egyptian ruler? King Tut. That question minus three for the majority of 28 the Googlers well remaining. I think we all agree that we can move on to this new question. Which type of sausage shares its name with a word meaning nonsense or rubbish? Oh, definitely Bratwurst in German. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> that was a bait. That was baloney. An achievement. Oh yeah, Everyone nice googling. Right answer to that question, thus putting no one in danger. New question coming up. Good Which powerful weapon did France test at Amurora Atoll in the Pacific, 1973? France test, 1973. Laser nerve gas. I guess hydrogen bomb. Like, what else would you be testing? Oh my god! <sighs> okay, minus three. For a lot of the competitors. Bravo to all of you. Vampire invasion is coming. And let's go for a whole new question. On which continent is the country of Croatia? No, oh, that's in Asia or South America. I'm pretty sure it's Asia. No problem with that question. Minus two. It didn't eliminate a lot of people in the end. <laughs> Bravo. Twenty three Googlers remaining. The questions follow each other and are not alike. The proof with this new question. Which fairy story features a witch house made of cakes and sweets? Three little pigs. That question really was easy. Minus yeah. one. Almost no Minus one. Minus one, no childhood. Life. Bravo. <sighs> you probably had well, an Xbox to too, right? Question, if you don't mind. Which breed of dog is the cartoon crime solving Scooby Doo? Ooh. Well, I know what is not. It's not a Rottweiler. It's not a German Shepherd. He's a Great Dane, most likely, right? Or Doberman Pinscher. Maybe Doberman Pinscher. I don't know. Oh my god! No problem with that question. Alright, we got some 19 yeah. Googlers remaining. Bravo. Pog. If I can beat these Googlers, that would be sick. You will be asked a new question now. Now! Which scientist is notable for having developed the Polio vaccine. Ooh, polio vaccine. I'm. I don't know. I'm gonna gamble. I'm gonna. I'm gonna gamble. Ooh. 
No! And this is the end of your great song. 16 Googlers! How can you live with yourself? 17 Googlers! Huh? I'm gonna see exactly who's Googling you. follow each other and are not alike. I can't scroll up. new question. Why can't I scroll up? Because the UI is for ants? Oh. What? Wait, is this all time high score? What? That question didn't pose any problems for the majority of our participants. Let's go for this new eliminatory question. What is the name of an island that was the business center of medieval and renaissance Venice? Chat, do you not realize I cannot spectate this? Because it will go on for literally hours until one Googler has to go to bed. Look, they're dropping like flies. Minus four. Oh, couldn't Google it but quick enough? The game is getting tougher now with this brand new question. What is a curricle? Curricle. Sounds like a headscarf. Horse carriage. Ah, they tried to bait it with other alternatives. When it was obviously Occam's Racer. Yes. Let's go for this new eliminatory question. Which Roman god is always depicted with two faces? Uh. Fuck is Janus? Who the fuck is Janus? That question was a toughie and did a lot of damage. Even I didn't know the answer. <laughs> Imagine that. The game is getting tougher now with this brand new question. Spandau is a suburb of which German city? Essen. Berlin. No problem with that question. It didn't eliminate a lot of people in the end. Last question. How did you decide the so winner? Let's move on to a whole new question. If you answer faster, you get more points. Oh. What is the literal translation of the name of the US criminal region Cosa Nostra? Uh, our concern. Mm, our. Our secret. Our concern. Ah, minus three. I didn't know that it was uh, first. I mean, three Googlers remaining. But you gotta be extra fast at Googling too, right? So you get most points.
It's all bots, the names are all Greek gods, but that was not the game I was playing right there, that, that list leaderboard. It was not the same as the people. It was? No, because when I got it, I when it popped up, when it popped up, it was showing someone had answered 10 questions. At Oh, it was updated uh, with every question? Oh. Alright. I didn't... <sighs> Can do local multiplayer. Yeah, me, myself, and Irene. Alrighty then. Thirty, thirty people. Twenty-nine Googlers. Hello and welcome to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Trust yourself and your acquaintances for this new question. Seven years of big mirror. Seven years of bad luck. I was the fastest, fastest drawer in the West. No problem with that question. Minus two. It didn't eliminate a lot of people in the end. Bravo. Let's go for this new eliminator. According to the Carol Silent Night, all is calm, all is. Uh. Uh, I don't actually remember. Uh, is it A or B? Let's say it has to be B. Yeah. That question Too many syllables in the other one. The majority of the participants. Well done. Our team of editors offers you Which of these is a popular question. pastime? Train dotting, train spotting. Train spotting. All right, you got to answer fast for the points. Many participants are still in All right, the running. 24 the Googlers win. remaining. Try to hold on to your position for as long as possible. I'm trying. Your new question is ready. Good luck. Island of Hokkaido forms part of which country? Sounds Japanese. Minus zero. Anyone, since everyone answered correctly. Twenty-four Excellent. Googlers remaining. Still. Good luck to you for this new question. In which Canadian province is French the only official language? Quebec. I've answered Insta on every question, almost except for one. We should be in the lead here. You know what it should be? You know what it should really be? It looks like that the person who answers last. Excellent. Uh, but that is right. Like, if you're wrong, you lose. But the person who's right, but answered last, Here's should also get the fuck out. So that the Googlers get fucked. Eventually. Uh, Kuwait is located on the coast of which body of water? Uh... 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 I think I'm not percent sure, but I don't know for a hundred. 
Okay, Googler is still in the game. Can you stop Googling? Okay, one guy lost because he didn't have time to Google. His Internet Explorer browser window froze or some shit. Now let's go to the next question, if you don't mind. In which British city is the Victorian Albert Museum uh, located? Victorian Albert. Oh my god, dude. I don't know. I'm just gonna assume London is a bait and just go with one of these. Go Manchester. I'm probably dead here. A bait. It looks like that question brought you bad luck. Oh, look at You've that! Been eliminated. Look at the stream snipers! Look at the stream snipers, huh? F minus four stream snipers, all getting baited by my wrong answer. Because huh? they're on a laptop, no time to alt tab. Look, look at all these cheaters. Can we get a, can we get a cheater free lobby? Hmm? Is that possible? With some honor, integrity. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna do go to the French server and pick French, all right? And that's that will be the stream sniper lobby, and uh, it will be an honor game of honorable people, right? Because there will be no normie googlers. Why France? I just assumed that was the lowest amount of people uh, playing on the French version. Because if it's uh, someone who knows less about the outside world than me... <laughs> Sacré bleu! Welcome to Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Are you ready to play today? Okay, let's go. 38. 37 Googlers. Let's go for this new eliminatory question. Complete the name of the legendary singer Roy... Who? Ball is on sphere, globe, orb. I'm just gonna go glob because everything else is uh, round. A globe. Is Sorry, it... it's over for you this time. Minus. But it was honestly an right. interesting game. That doesn't count. And let's go for a whole new question. Who? Literally, man. Legendary singer. I'm a fucking legendary singer in comparison. Singer of Pretty Woman. I can sing Pretty Woman. Pretty Woman walking down the street. Doesn't make me legendary. Alright, get in. 12 seconds. Not enough Googlers. You picked a great day to join us on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire? Get ready. I think we all agree that we can move on to this new question. Move on from what? Well, how would you normally begin a game of golf? Uh, tee off. 
I guess. I don't fucking remember. T is a T. Everyone made it through a minus zero, huh? How convenient. To that question. Bravo to all of you. It's time to move on to a new question. Which game played on an electronic table involves aiming a small ball at targets by using flippers? Pinball. That question really was easy. Mine is one. Almost no one got tripped up by it. Bravo. Trust yourself and your acquaintances for this new question. Which Olympic event features a spherical metal ball weighing 16 pounds? What? Uh, spherical. Wait. A spheric sphere. Uh, what? what? The fuck is hammer? I have oh, never heard of hammer, and neither have these guys. What a shame! What is a hammer? I. The game is getting tougher now with this brand new question. They're all Greek gods, for real. That question didn't seem to pose a problem for anyone. Alright, I make a game then. Can you... Could you not make a game? Why would they lie? There is none. Local multiplayer. Taking turns. Taking turns. Is there some way we can get chat to vote? Is there some way we can make chat? Is there a built in voting function on Twitch? Me versus you. Yeah, but is there a fast way to do it? I forgot what they have nowadays. Poll on Twitch. Is that a fast way? How do you do that? I, I don't remember the last time I asked chat for anything. Uh, hi, I'm Nato, thank you for one year, Fortune 1, join the badge, figure about the Toxic Secura and uh, Richard Nixon. Click map. Map. Mod view. Website chat dot vote is pretty good for quick voting. Uh, chat dot vote is it actually a good site? Mod. No, that's not it. Mod view. No. That's oh. Not it. Hello. Mod. Where's this handsome guy? All right. Uh. How do we do this? Where's the fucking poll function? With activity. Predictions. Is prediction? No. It's not it. Uh, uh, it's slash poll. Four questions, four question poll at the same time. 
Paul has a minimum vote time of one minute. That's too long. All right, chat, chat dot vote. Oh, that was that the site name? Okay, that was a site name. Uh, Twitch chat poll. Sign in with Twitch. Okay, I'm gonna connect. We'll do it. It's me versus you. And you have poll option. Now this is gonna be scuffed as chat because. If you do, if I enter poll option, and I, it's not fun because it's always A, B, C, D, right? A, B, A, add, B, add, C, add, D, add, okay. Uh, start voting. I can press the start voting. Okay. Okay. I start. I start. Uh, hang on. I... Let's not do taking turns. Let's actually do a normal run and then uh, we see who gets the furthest. I think it will be the best because otherwise it will be too much switching back and forth for me and otherwise I can just have it open all right I think it's best all right let's say all right I start I start I start I start the score you have to beat Yep. Yep, 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 yep. I start. Which town in Umbria is San Francis most associated? What is this uh, $100 question? Okay, so donkey, mule, burro means donkey in Spanish. Assisi. Ass. Uh, Forsen, there is no one line on this game. There is only single player and butts. Here is the stand page. There is only 24 people total playing this game. I believe you. That's why we switched. Oh my god, I don't know this. Uh, you don't have any question. By using the flip, you decided to be wise. What the fuck? Treasure who is it on throne? Game show host. Yeah, I'm confident. I'm saying C. I'm saying C. Just new question. Oh. Or uh, are you uh, said to dish if you reveal scandal about someone? The dirt. And I'm going to say A. How are we gonna use lifeline? Yeah. You're not. Absolutely. It's uh, incorporated in the Obviously, fact that, that you right are uh, already googling. So. Sure. Where can we see Santa oh, Claus Village? It's, it's easier when you're behind the screen. In Lapland. A? Yeah, let's go for A. You had to make a choice. Is that your fun? It's time to move on to a. In small says, who is Clark Kent's best friend? Selena Kyle, that's Catwoman. Louis Lane is the reporter, so I'm assuming that that's his best friend. Okay. Well, the right answer is C. Okay. Sad, but it's the game. This is not the right answer. No way! Uh, Lewis's lane is gonna be pissed hearing that. Game? Uh, I forgot to check what. Uh, I forgot to check what. Uh, I have to check after each everyone. I I don't know what I am that, and we don't know. One one more. Uh, we have to keep track of which one I'm on. All right. That was just to see. That was just to see. No, I, I'll check now. I'll keep in mind which one I'm on. 
Alright. There we go. Uh, what is the name of the skill which involves keeping several objects in there? Juggling. Yeah, this is the one no matter what. No matter what. Final answer. Okay, now we're on question two. Alright. We're on question two. Uh, on which continent are Niagara Falls in North America? Is that your final? Yes. That is correct. All right. Which of these palindromes is used in an Olympic uh, aquatic sport? Uh, kayak. No, it's All right. definitely a. All right. Now we're on question Ready four. We're keeping track this time because we're playing serious. Uh. Yeah, question four. Which country do, do Chianti and Valpolicea wines come from? Well, either uh, Spain or Italy. Or France or Portugal. I'm gonna swap the question. No, I'm not gonna swap the question. Because I would have heard about these wines if it was from Spain. So it must be from Italy. Or Portugal. Most likely Italy. I'm gonna swap the question though. Trust but I didn't say which one it was. For this new question. Quentin Tarantino's debut feature film was titled Reservoir What? Dogs. Hey? Yeah, which one was it from? Final end. Just own it. You got it. It was Italy. Okay. okay. It's time to move on to a new question. What animal is Honest John in the Pinocchio movie? Honest John. He's a uh, fox or a wolf. I'm gonna assume he's a fox. But fox aren't honest. Maybe that's the point. I remember there being a wolf and a fox, maybe. I don't know. Okay, All audience, right. this question is worth a good prize. Take a good look at it. And vote it's now. probably bait. B. It was a fox. My asshole. B. No doubt. So the threshold. All right. We're on question six here. What is another name for? Or we beat five. Let's just make it easy. We beat five. What is the another name for a spit used in cooking? This is the only one I recognize. Patissere rotissere. Brasier. From now on, the 50-50 will 50 -50. remove two... Then it's no, patissere. It's definitely A. Unfortunately, all right. it all all right. all right, it happens. It this happens. Is not the right answer. So uh, it was unlucky. I shouldn't take a 50-50 on this one. But uh, okay. Congratulations! You are leaving here with your safe. Okay, let's just see if it wo works. S start voting. All right. A, B, C, D. It works for me. Uh, it works. Can you guys see the results of this or no? Uh, caps, caps, caps is what I wrote. I don't know if it's case sensitive. I'm just wondering if you can see the results. You cannot see the results, so you cannot be influenced by the people uh, insta voting. Okay, that's good. Because then we don't need a time limit. Oh, but you can see in chat, actually. What do you guys vote for? Uh, all right, it's fine. It's fine. Someone was, we're gonna have some baiters in there probably. Uh, all right, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna restart it when the question has been put on the screen. All right, so that people don't preemptively type the wrong answer though. All right, here you go, chat. This is your run. A, B, C, or D, starting without timer. I'm gonna give you... No, I... we'll do with timer for you. 
so that uh, I will click it every time uh, right before the last second right makes sense all right who do you want to be who do you want to be hot girl old man this is the hot girl okay All right, the question will start. When I say. When the timer starts. Ready for this new question. No. Now. It's capital. Um, it doesn't work, chat. It it says eleven votes. It's you are lagging the shit out of this. Is there a way to make it better? Uh, per user limit is one. Total suggestion limit zero. Unlimited means unlimited. It's lagging too much. It's one, two, three, four. What? It's numbers. Oh, it's numbers. Ah, it's numbers. It's one, two, three, four. Okay, now I get it. Okay, one is A, two is B, C is three. Okay, I'm gonna give you another chance here, chat, because that was embarrassing. All right, now we get it, okay. Okay, okay. All right, type one, two, three, fours in the chat. Yeah, okay, that works better. Okay, I'm gonna stop voting. Okay, here we go. You only have one, so you only have to type once. Uh, your vote only counts once. Okay. Uh Okay. All right. Starts. It starts. It starts. Now, if you're annoyed, you might tell someone to go jump in the blank. I'm not gonna say who's in the lead, but you are not wrong. Okay, it is Lake. A is going to be the right answer. I can feel it. All right, stop voting. Waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. Is this your final answer? That's my final answer. Okay. All right. The computer validated your answer. That you were right, chat. Right All right, you were right. Okay, next one. Next I one. We all agree that we can move on to this. All right, starting now. Which country has brought home the most gold medals in judo at the Olympics? Belgium, Japan, Sweden, or the Netherlands? All right. All right, you're saying C, Japan. I'm going to choose C. Final answer? That will be my final answer. All right, let's find out the right answer together. I have no idea. Of course. I needed to keep my cool and it paid off. Good All right, you for next question. question. Oh, uh, Granny Smith is the variety of which fruit? 
Pear, apple, grape, or banana? Huh? You like getting kindergarten questions? Feeling good about yourself? Hey, Richard Nix, I think we're one year, by the way. KKI 14 house, it's lupus. He says, repeating, of course. Oh, shit, I almost forgot to vote. Uh, Blind Knight with four years is forced an emote. Thank you, mm, old school. That's my final answer. Emote. Oh, I can't wait to see the correct answer. That's what we were looking for. That's next what you were looking for. Okay, next one. All right, next one. Trust yourself and your acquaintances for this new question. All right, starting voting now. Think. Uh, what is the name of the cruise ship in Star Wars Rebels? Ooh, first time it's a little bit split here, huh? Uh, are you just the look at this look at these cucks in chat I see what you're doing if you don't know you just chill and wait until you see the majority is spamming one C I'm confident that it's I see I see okay. your strategy here huh? I don't know what the fuck There's you're doing your final answer and then you just spam the same My shit as them huh? yeah okay the computer validated your answer okay let's see what it is you let's see. It off. Okay. I needed to keep my cool and it paid off. And let's go for a whole new question. Okay. What is the main unit of currency in Canada? Bro. <sighs> Why are you guys getting elementary school questions? Well, what is what is that? Rigged shit, man. Huh? All right, D for dollars. Let's try D. You know what my next question is, right? Is this your final answer? That will be my final answer. The choice we need anonymous made. voting. That's what we really need, man. We need money anonymous voting. Now I'm saying that you wouldn't have failed this question, but I'm saying in general. Uh, we need fucking anonymous voting here. Let's go for this new eliminatory question. All right. Starting now. What were the 1980s icons in the Commodore 64 and Spectrum ZX81? Okay, you get lucky every time, huh, chat? You weren't even born. Sports cars is winning right now. I'm just kidding. I'm a gambler, and so I'm choosing D. I know right. you were waiting for me to ask you. So let's go. <laughs> is this your final answer? Mm, that's my final answer. Questions are easier because of no it's time, time limit. Discover the right what? Answer. You mean that you have a time limit? Are time limit questions easier than okay. no time limits? Wait, what? Now that you've released the pressure, here's a new question. Let's take a deep right. breath and start over from the beginning. Which band was named for its financial plight when formed? Ooh, we got Giga Split here. Giga Split. Where's it gonna be? Oh my god! I'm just kidding. Because you guys wait. Let's go with the right answer and therefore bitch. You know what my next question is, right? Is this your final answer? That's my final answer. You have given your final answer. I hope it is the right one. That's what we were looking for. That's right. I took the time I needed, but at least the results are there. Are you ready? Hmm. All right, starting. In which century, century did the first crusade begin?
Uh, yeah, here they come. Last second voters, huh? D, on route to the win. Last second I voters, I see them answer. rushing in there. So let's go. Is this your final Little answer? Bitches, well, yes, that's my final answer. The choice is made. It's time to discover the right answer. You really know your answer. I needed to keep my mail in and voters. Off. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Make it 10 seconds only. I can make it 10 seconds. I can make it the 10 seconds. to a good start, but you shouldn't stop there. Here is a new question. For me. All right, you only have 10 seconds from now on. Sorry now. 25, sorry, 15 is where I will. At 15, I will do the one with most. I'm All right, sure now it's a lot closer, huh? So now it's a lot closer. That's my final answer. You have made your choice. You took your time, but you are right. Okay, next one. Will you be able to answer this new question as well? All right. Start now. You're ten seconds until twenty. Oh my God! It's giga even. It's giga even. Uh, Let's try D. I give you two extra seconds, but final answer. You sure? Yes, that's my final answer. The choice is made. You got there. Well done. At the pace you're going, you're going to make short work of this new question. All right, starting now. You have until 35. Oh, sorry. 33. Because I fucked up. And it's A. Is that your final answer? I don't even have time to read the question. That's my final answer. Now it's time to find out the correct answer. I have to announce to you that this is Look not at these idiots. The right we said so, two. Two isn't even there. Well, and first of all, it was effective. almost split between <laughs> one and two. Alright? Right? But you were wrong regardless. But huh? Still can't Google you fast enough? Prize. You can't spell municipalism. Huh? <laughs> Bunch of cheaters in chat. Bunch of cheaters in chat. I have proven it. Huh? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> la 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 la. If I would have given you 10 seconds from the start, you would have lost in the start, man. Nobody type one. Are you? Huh? Are you? Even if you type two, the answer was three. All right. Three was the second least voted option. Yeah, but you didn't know that. All right. The last three seconds or whatever, all right, it was even. A was slightly in the lead, which is one, and then two overtook it a little way later on, all right, because people were just waiting for the tours to fight two, and the tours were just dumb because they were wrong. We couldn't even read the question. And welcome to my life, huh? I can't even read the questions right. Mm, flat man, Maggie Mike, let's keep. We'll call the draw, chat. We'll call the draw. We'll, we'll have to settle this in a more fair way some other time. But not today. Today we are good to go. Tomorrow, however, is another day in the arena. I will be back, alright? 
then but until then i thank you guys for watching today thanks for all the subs resubs donors gifted subs bitcoin social credits i will catch you in the next episode all right until then bye 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 bye